we here? Hello, everybody. Hello, we're here. That's <gasps> Hello. We, are we, back. we disappear after every episode, and we only reappear when we return to the next episode. What mm -hmm. about so all the like, other shows that we put on? You reappear. <laughs> Some other. People what reappear. other show? <laughs> What other yeah. show? There's no, no, it's there's no show. Oh, just only yeah. we're lost in the sure. abyss. Please help, please. Never stop watching us. And never stop donating to the channel. Hi, um, we have Soundscape in the background because Soundscape's awesome, and we also have a mix of the soundtracks from the, um, from the official soundtracks from Sun Evoke from City Mist, um, and a few sound effects as well because. Why not have sound effects? <laughs> oh, I do have a new sound effect for um, for um, Christine as well. Um, just want to test this yeah. out. Yeah. Yeah. It's the only thing that came up when I typed in fashion. So, ah. um, and I've also got Nightmare as well for Christine. Is that a xylophone? I think it might be a bit loud. I think it's still a little bit loud. I had trouble getting the sound volumes low enough. That's Kel's xylophone. Um, but mm. we do have sound effects. We have all uh, pieces. Um, we have an amazing overlay and artwork done by Hidekiro Chibi. Check her out at bestokecc.com.au. Um, and we're part of the Roll20 Ambassador program. Um, we run our games through Roll20, even though Polly's running it mostly off spreadsheets and PDFs uh. and other bits and pieces. Um, all our role-playing in interface, um, the roles, the character sheets and whatnot are done through Roll20. We've even been able to upload the character sheet, sorry, the rules in as PDFs into Roll20 so we can quick reference them instead of having to pick up physical, physical books or etc. Um, so yeah um i might start to put like statuses if i you know what i should do i should try to like you know like for example in rule 20 if i want to give somebody a status i could just drag and drop it here you know i might try that we're gonna try that this time you see how it's a, a cheat before? sheet to be useful Ooh. yeah where, where are you uh, drag and dropping uh i i don't really know <laughs> you know i'm just you know, she might be on a different no... different screen to us because oh. we have our we just use the city mist um map screen ah okay oh. gotcha thank you yes that's the possibility um yeah. so we also okay. use the city mist map screen and whatnot um because it's pretty and it's good and it's a nice little good reference for that we use and um but that's all our paperworking stuff you can help donate every donation mm. you do um helps us out and gives us pluses to the show like to for moves <laughs> and stuff like that so cool um that's right. other than that we do um intros so um christine uh, Gabriella. Hi. <laughs> hi. Uh, my name is Gabriella. I am uh, purely existing as a player for this show. So once the shows come off, my whole existence just kind of disappear. Just like your reflection in the mirror. Always be there behind a screen waiting to replace you. And then you will be the one behind the mirror. <laughs> but it's probably not something you have to worry about, dear, dear viewer. Uh, and I'll be playing Christine. Okay. A um, fashionista, influencer, um, who is more who is more expensive than uh, your life, your parents' life, and your grandparents' life. That just seems weird, but okay. Sure. Um, Oblivion. Oh, I'm, am I in the right spot now? I was going to yes. introduce myself as Paul. Um, so <laughs> I, my name is uh, Viv. I go by Oblivion on the internet. Um, I play Mavis Thorne, who is a literature student um, at the Payne Town University. Um, I mean, I'm a good person. Uh, whatever, whatever my party members say, whatever anyone else says, besides the MC, because she's on my side, obviously. Um, I am a good person. And um, That's don't let everyone else, if they say I'm not, they're gaslighting you. Um, I mean, literally, I could never be evil. I'm a good person. 
I pay my taxes. Yep, that is true. Check out a highlight reel. Where's, where's the wand? No. no. Check out a highlight reel. And there was a nice little mm -hmm. introduction of an NPC recently. Came up in the pre-show. Anyway, Chris Tricks. Oh, hey. Uh, drowning in girls, drowning in general. Kel Daly. How's it going? <laughs> okay, that's shorter than I expected. Um, <laughs> I think I said all I needed to say. I think you said all you needed to say. Cool. Hi, my name is Garage Goblin. I'm playing Chuck, the um, idiot of the group. Um, I like playing idiot characters because they're more fun and I can get away far more. Um, and most of the time, people choose to hate him, so I'm okay with that too. Um, Paul? Idiot no longer, may I add. No. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. My name is Paul. I have the pleasure of playing Penny Roberts. She is a student reporter at the City of Duskwall University. Um, recently, things have taken a rather absurd turn, and we're going to investigate that and see what's wrong. Uh, Raven? Hi, I'm uh, Raven Rook. I'm playing Alex Storm, uh, sixth year senior and teaching assistant, and possibly now Chuck's minder. I I don't know. Um, we, we seem to do a lot of things together now. Yeah, it's kind of a thing where if Chuck gets passed on to the to anyone that will take him, um, it's oh, a babysitting people yeah. have mentioned, and it's mostly Maeve that's <coughs> organising the schedule for other I, people. <clears throat> I would for rather people. Charlie pay you to babysit Chuck because the get last him time out of my face. The last time it was just Wait, that's Maeve a pretty good offer because Alex is pretty cash poor. Because the last time it was just Maeve and, Christine and, <laughs> and Chuck, she almost killed Chuck. So I feel like she's like, someone else take care of him, please. When, when did you almost kill Chuck? I, I, sorry, I, but Paul, I, that I, one was... I, I thought about it. You know, there was like, it was, I just could just wrap my hands around his, his very dumb little neck and just. Listen, that's way better off than hanging out with Christine because in the back of her mind, there's always this little voice that said, Erase him from existence. Erase him from existence. Just do it. I have found Chuck to be nothing but heroic. And quite frankly, all of this judgment just seems unfounded. Totally. Uh, I don't know, and that could be dumb. Hmm. Anyways, Polly. <laughs> anyway, Polly. <laughs> are, we, are we ready yet? Okay. I, so I, I just wanted to know like, about this, this murder scene, but okay, Polly, go. So uh, I am Polly. I am the MC of this of of this weird game. And when last we met, the the crew decided to absolutely destroy my professor and uh, deal a blow to what appears to be a cult. However, we don't know how high up the ladder of the cult. Maybe Professor Clay, now deceased, was the leader of the cult. And you have defeated the entire cult? Maybe you have not. We have uh, yet to find out. But at the beginning of every session, there is a move that, that must be taken. It is called the voiceover monologue. And today we have a special presentation for you, apparently. It seems like many of our crew members will uh, contribute to a joint voiceover monologue. I'm very excited. I'm going to hear this for the first time when you do. Uh, take it away, crew. Okay. Last time on the city of Paintown. Life got a little complicated right off the bat with me and my childhood friend Mavis got drafted into a death cult where we were separated into lambs and wolves. And with titles like that, it doesn't take a genius to figure out what they wanted us to sacrifice in the end. As I was getting bolted down with the other lambs, water wetting my new shoes, I eventually, like the badass I am, got out of my cuffs. Wondering all the while where the fuck the other two went. We pa we paused our nightly patrol to meet up with an, with my informant, a real piece of work, failing detective who was out to get me because his girl founded my fan club. He swore he was legitimate this time, though. He was a complete mess and drunk, um, as drunk as a frat house kegger. He just came from a meeting with his client, Sammy, Sammy's kid has been taken. But the thing, but the thing is, we met, we met his client earlier that day on patrol. 
where we saved him and his kid from a fire dragon. Sammy, the client, um, also mentioned that Holiday was such a mess and was trying to, uh, that Holiday was trying to blackmail him um, to get to his boss. Um, Holiday was such a mess when we tried to get the information out of him that I had to call in help from the storm. Are you really calling me that, Charles? <sighs> Fortunately, my powers proved particularly unreliable, but we did manage to gather some interesting data on a magical rattle. Um, Holiday's knowledge of a slate, um, perhaps pertaining to eternal life, made me wonder if indeed Sammy's disappearance was tied to that ritual Maeve and Kel were at. After pushing my shelf off to the second floor, I found the rest of the wolves and Mavis seconds away from turning the wheel that would have killed me. Oh, hold on a second. Hold on now. Uh, our plan was specifically do what we need to do to infiltrate the cult. You know, I checked in. Are we doing this? You were like, yeah, sure, let's do it, girlfriend. Okay, great. So I did everything that I wanted. we had to do. I followed the plan completely from beginning to end. And, you know, I'm just a little, you know, maybe, did I desire the power of the cult? Maybe, maybe, but like, you don't know that anyways, and you won't remember this anyways, so whatever, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I did kind of desire the power of the cult, and did I want to steal it for myself? A little bit, yeah, and I'm a little mad that I didn't get to do that. But I think the more, <laughs> the moral of it is that, I mean, you know, imagine you're just sitting there being, doing what you're told, and then following the plan, and then suddenly you pop out of the water, and you're like, Maeve, help me. I, I had to improv and then I accidentally killed that poor dude because I didn't even know how much oh. I had to exert on Forza. I had no assessment of the situation. You know what? I just want to say this out loud and I don't care what anyone else says. Penny would not have done that to me. Penny would have followed the plan. Oh, I don't know yeah. why I paused for so long. That's crazy. Um, anyway, jumping back down to save the others, my lockpick snaps as the loss of the lambs. A very combative Emma Bailey kicks me away from her vines. I think this is it. This is the first time I take, for, uh, this is the first life I take for being so unprepared. When suddenly the doors open and out of nowhere, Christine. Show of trust and time to stay the day. Like totally hunting gorgeous sunset. It is your goddess, Christine Chu, and I continue to shatter ceiling and breaking down doors like the fabulous, ferocious fashion queen that I am. Did I hijack Professor Irrelevant Party? Yes. Did I raise a mob of fans to overwhelm his fanatic? <laughs> Guilty as charge. Did I convince those cultists that I am the goddess monarch realness? Absolute to the fabulously, honey. It is choo choo time, and we're opening doors, bitch. With the crazy professor taken out and a fertility list of only one, I hope, whatever darkness I saw in my dear friend was just a trick of the light. After all, it could, if I couldn't trust her, who can I trust? And seeing. <laughs> all right, thank you. Wow, that was good. Thank you, everybody. That was uh, <clears throat> excellent work. Yeah, we have instituted a new rule here to reward people for, for providing a voiceover monologue. If you can tie sometime during this session uh, your action to part of your voiceover monologue, I am rewarding you all who, uh, who have given the voiceover monologue uh, a juice. So it's sort of like it's a, you know, it's a little bit of a flashback point that you can, you can use as we proceed. However, you did completely destroy uh, a, 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 a professor's plan and uh, did not remain in the cult you were uh you know you stopped one of their major initiation uh uh the things they do to initiate new members of the cult uh and you revealed yourselves to be traitorous uh malcontents who were never really true to the god king and you have yet to find out what those consequences may be you you are now mask off it, it will it would seem that you could be an enemy of the cult that may or may not have any consequences. I doubt there's going to be any consequences of that, but if there are, maybe it wouldn't, won't be that huge of a surprise. Let's say this. At the end of the scene there, you met a one Emma Bailey who turned out to be a flight attendant. However, you had to make haste out of there. A party had sprung up out of nowhere in this, this large frat house. A party 
like no other. Nobody quite remembers who planned it, but it seemed like it was well planned. So it must have been one of the fraternity members. Uh, nobody seems to understand why the VIP room was in the middle of a forest, but it turns out that it was near a water tower that uh, seems to be have abandoned for, for quite a while. It, nobody has any sense that anything was going on there, except for perhaps the participants. Uh, you made haste out of there, we'll say it was late. And where, where should we pick up the action? What has been going on since? Anybody? <clears throat> um, I want to go back to my apartment with Ken, <laughs> at least, um, and Christine. Um, my apartment, I would love to go back to my apartment. And I would like mm -hmm. to... Um, bring Christine and Kellen. I'll text everyone and be like, we're going to meet back at my apartment. I assume it takes them a little while longer. But um, yeah, I think Maeve just kind of like, as they get in and like shut the door, she just like look at Kellen and be like, what was that? <laughs> okay, okay, I can explain this. No, no, no. I, I, I know what you did. the party? <laughs> no, I, I know what you did. I saw it on You threw media, that? That's, that was fucking dope. I'm not going to lie. Oh. I love that. Of course. It's all I kind of, I low key wanted to like stay and like hang out, to be honest. Yeah, I totally hijacked that whole frat party and turned it into an actual frat party. No, There's, like, like, yeah. Drugs everywhere. I would have gone to that party, to be honest. Oh, also, can I just say, um, I, uh, before this, <laughs> Emma Bailey, I kind of like, like shook sense that like, what to live. <laughs> You're crazy. Just have the will to live, you crazy person. And then fucking dip. She said, I, well, yeah. She, uh, here's her response to that. You think I didn't? You just killed me. You stole from me eternal life. And you God, you're dramatic. <laughs> okay, drama queen. You're, okay. You were, now I gotta go back off. to work. You know how <laughs> terrible it is on airplanes these to days. To be a flight attendant, you get paid yeah, bank, people, dude. People start fights. It's nuts. You get to um, leave. Actually, I think they had. I, I think they are more you exposed too. to radiation, so maybe that's not like a really good job. But that's beside the point. I actually don't care. Um, can however, we just go? however, you did. Um, you did learn. Um, learn something. How did you learn? <laughs> tell me. Tell me. What did you observe that gave you uh, a clue as to what airline she worked for, or how you could find her in the? Is she wearing her uniform or? No, no, no. She was wearing a, bl uh, a a black shirt that said "lamb" on it. Was it the same air hostess that we saw in the uh, cafe? Yes, it was. So you could you could then, then we do go, know. go there. All right, there you go. I throw a scrap of paper wanted, with my number. I just wanted to uh, <laughs> underscore that you uh, you still. It's not like she's gone. Yeah, don't worry. Is... I throw a piece of paper with my number. <laughs> it's wow, like calorie. when you fix yourself. Call me. <laughs> or it just seems like Kel has uh, is really interested in damaged goods like Maeve and, ah, yeah. <laughs> and now I'm like trying to pick up a cultist. Yeah, you do. Kel loves the clearance though, yeah. section. Uh, <laughs> love damaged goods. Woo woo. Anyways, um, she's kind of like a you know I sort of played her just now a little bit too dramatic. She's more like mousy. She'd be like, you took, you took life from Adorable. me. Adorable. Huh? Yeah, you know? yeah. So I was trying to live forever in this. Oh, now I got to go to work. Figure it out. <laughs> yeah. Okay, go cry to a therapist about it. We don't care. Can we just you go can, now? My therapist I care doesn't a bit. want to talk I care to me. A little. I'll um, be a therapist. No, wait. I can't that's that's that. a your problem. Let's go. Let's go. I'm, okay, I'm we'll so go. Ahead. Ahead. We'll go. Me. I think we can get along. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> you seem like my kind of uh, a person. Okay. <sighs> I'm good. I'm good. I gotta go. We go back to the apartment. Bye. Oh. Bye. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right. Get get in the car. Don't worry All about right. it. Oh, were you flirting with the cultist? What was? I was what? <laughs> huh? What is happening? No, of course she not. You realized you were flirting, and that changed her whole uh, uh, way. <laughs> Maybe I okay. did have something to live for in this life. Oh no. Okay. So now that I answer <laughs> many questions, I have a question for you two. What the hell? Why is there so much water? My shoe is wet. Tell me about it. Mine too. <laughs> I got you Jordans. This is crazy. Because 
they wanted us to sacrifice to get, show a faith that we could sacrifice ourselves and our morality and our lives to join the cult to be whatever with the sun the the god king whatever and so that's... i was following it completely yeah and... i mean duh that's all the all the thing that you just described is just like subscribing to my channel the problem exactly. is right uh they bolted us down to like the lower levels and then fucking tried to drown us yeah but i'm pretty Turns sure they have a good recruiting actually... which isn't it really the same as paying 599 mechanism. to be honest oh um cal do you remember haze week i think that's just what hazing is see the difference with haze week was that i didn't fucking die <laughs> I mean, I don't know. The way that you were chucking through those oatmeal bottles was cool. demonic. I <laughs> actually, I vomited for like a good 10 minutes. It was crazy. Oh, Why do we was... do that? <laughs> Guys, um, sorry, Kel, sorry. Kel, when we make yep. a plan, mm -hmm. we should stick with it. I mean, like, this cult was like, I don't think he was, you know, he could, if he was the head bad, then like, great. But we didn't deal with the cult at all. We just kind of took out, and I didn't even want to kill him. Like I, mm -hmm. I didn't mean to. And I'm sorry oh, that you had I'm... to. I... Oh, you killed well, Professor aside. Irrelevant. I'm sorry yes, you had to do I, that. I'm sorry I you had to take a life. To. I didn't. I didn't. You, you kind of like threw me off. I didn't even know what was happening, and then suddenly yeah, I'm in the dress again, fair. and now I've killed someone. This is like great, super. Great. I didn't expect any of this to happen, and I'm sorry you had to take a life. No one Wait, should have yeah, to do you, that. I'm sorry. You two literally go into a cult initiations and then you just like literally telling me you don't expect this to happen. To die? Mm -hmm. I didn't think we expect? were gonna kill him. I, I I thought we had agreed like at the door that he wasn't gonna die or that we didn't need to we were just gonna go through with what was happening. I didn't think I think we were gonna kill him. Also I'm pretty sure logically I'm pretty, speaking, no. why would they kill their own cultist member? then they're going to run out of cultists. That's the point of hazing. We're not actually trying to kill the people that's joining the sorority. We just want to create enough trauma so they feel like psychologically indebted. Yeah. Mm -hmm. or, or at trauma least bonding. they were going to keep uh -huh. us. It was just a show of faith. And I think when I noticed that he was exerting so much power, I, I knew he was doing something. He wasn't flowing the water. So like, it must have been something to do with you guys. At least I was, I was hopeful. And frankly, it just... I, I I think you can say all that, but at the end of the day, you weren't the one at the bottom of a very large cavern, slowly filling up with water, losing the ability to breathe, dude. Okay, no, um, I get it, but like if I if I was like, let's no, go I don't get it. I don't I get it. I'm I going would. to defend Maeve here because, okay. like, literally, again, as established, you chuck those old meal bottles. You could have died from that. More than that, other thing. Mm. <laughs> hey, it's so not healthy for you. It and is. I wouldn't no. let you die. I just, I could kind of see you down there, and frankly, it didn't really feel like you were gonna die. So I wouldn't have brought you into a situation like that if I thought you were gonna die. But it just, it bothers me that like you, it feels like it's fine. It doesn't matter. You know what? We're just gonna move for forward from it, and um, no, we just no, like, we're not going to we have move a forward. plan. Next time we have a plan, let's just follow through with it so that we don't have Maeve accidentally kill someone. Okay. All right. So I, I think that's I a great place where uh, Alex and, <laughs> and Penny and uh, Karsh arrive back at the headquarters, opening the door to... And you killed someone? Oh, hey, guys. Oh, I'm so glad you're safe! Come here, all of you! <laughs> um, okay, don't touch me. My outfit is wet right now. Oh. Okay. Because the silo was like... filled with water. How'd the cult go? Are, are you now cultists? Wait, uh, mm. The no. professor mm. was back like... to killing someone. Killing someone? Oh, killing someone? Uh, okay, oh, Maeve did, did it. Maeve did it. It's a long story, okay, but basically the professor is no longer an issue, okay? I did not mean for it to happen. It kind of just... I Kel said, help me, and I, I freaked out, and I killed him and it's not kel's fault it's my fault it doesn't it's fine we'll take okay. responsibility on it uh, you, you're not gonna take he's no longer an issue you're not a mafia boss you didn't just kill him to remove him what the hell happened Wait, okay hold up 
how, how did you kill him actually? Because it um, like there was no body left or nothing. Yeah, he turned to ash. I actually um I don't really know. I kind of blacked out. Um, but uh, yeah, you were very. It looked cool. I just yeah, I'll just say that. I L- looked cool. How? How did Bubbles cool. turn someone to ash? Well, I think I beat him to death. It will, them, it's all about physics, but I exploded. don't think the physics work in this case. I know. I know they like. That's they rather disprove his claims of immortality. And then he. Exp- I don't think he was the God King. Um, for sure. Like, I'm pretty sure he's not the God King. But he no, because be. you need the tablet for that. What tablet? Also. What? What? We collected like data. Would you oh. be interested? Uh, yeah, anything yeah, to stop actually, talking about the person that I just yeah. I um, so, that. first first part of data. Um, Christine, are you like responsible for this? I have like fifteen invites to a party. Um, to a big keger. Is it? Are you a lamb? Or are you a wolf still trendy? <laughs> just asking for a friend. Um, that friend is me. Guilty. <laughs> well, no. It, it just like they said like to dress up. It's like lambs and wolves at the keg yeah. party. That was me. I hijacked the coat. I turned it into my party. I turned the frat house into a proper frat house. You all are welcome. That Thank right you. has now been that's wrong has now been right in the world. A frat house should never be about study or advancing your professional career or personal growth. It's about partying. And that's my fucking frat week. leader. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Right, so uh Wait a second. I... So cults are also allowed because you didn't say it's not about anything to do with cults. Oh, uh, I just like hijacked the whole cult and then said that I'm the god dead, like goddess queen or whatever, uh, and then casually open the side of this just filled with people drowning. So you can say that I'm like a savior. No, no, I, I'm again? just just being be specific here. You, 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 you said the facts are not about study. You didn't say they're not about cults and sacrifice. Well, yeah, actually, I was never like that bothered with them being a cult. I was more bothered that they were studying in the weekend in a frat party. That's just wrong. What was the tag again so we could do a story on it for the paper? Hashtag. Um, Wolf go, wolf go, wolf, and uh, lamb go bar. Yes. Yeah. Creative. Very, Very um, freak show. <laughs> Thank you. Know. You're welcome. <laughs> so oh, I'm just party. glad you guys are Penny. okay. You clearly went for a hell of a thing. So Penny, Penny, uh, Hi. while you're while you're wondering about or while you're thinking about the school paper, you happen to look at your phone and you get a text message. Who's your like editor? I'd imagine it probably be one of the teachers overseas okay. the work. Okay. Well, uh, what's their name? Bill Payne. <laughs> Bill Bailey? Yeah, yeah. How about this? Uh, how about uh, Bill White? Bill White. Okay. Sounds Wait, good. Isn't, okay. Hold on. There's already a character named Bill White. I'm pretty sure, right? Isn't it the guy that oh, runs right. the foundry? Hold on a second. Um, okay, hold on. Hold on. Is, uh, Bill Wrong? Good oh, for Bill. Heisenberg. How about, how about Bill, Bill Bobber? Uh, okay. Chemistry teacher we'll Heisenberg. Um, what's that? Chemistry teacher Heisenberg. Heisenberg. Yeah, why not? Okay, okay. All right. So uh, Heisenberg, Bill Heisenberg, <laughs> mm-hmm. uh, sends you a text message and uh, says, "Wow, we've got a you know, um, we've got a story here. Uh, this happened really fast. Uh, the cops are already calling. They think there's a serial killer of." like faculty at at the university message me when you get this uh i need to make a call <laughs> she'll just walk out the door close it behind her don't leave mm-hmm. <sighs> okay all right um so why are we Is waiting for penny, penny getting a booty call oh Oof. what her girlfriend's standing right there don't be insensitive she'll at least get the call like when when Penny's not here, come on. Not um, usually. No. Okay. Listen. Penny's I want like to know. Chuck, focus. 
And it's, I know it's bad enough coming from me because you all know I'm very not focused. And I know that about myself. But anyway, I need to know the tea on holiday. What's up? What's good? Did he get a new low in his life? Alcoholism, something. Oh, well, tell me more. Remember his There's name. Good. But hold on. Oh, yeah. Yes, I remember, I remember his name. His name. No, yeah, you keep you. like Christine has never remembered his name before. <laughs> it's because Chuck keeps saying it that I was like, I was like, oh my goodness, who Wait. is this irrelevant guy, and why do you care? Have you, have you got a thing for me? Is oh, that what? why you're remembering things about me? Chuck, oh my goodness, no what's up with guys either. tonight and falling in love with me? <laughs> no, you're obsessed with me. It's, it's so easy to fall in love with. That's why. <laughs> Thank you. Chip, still in denial state. So Wait, uh, who's in denial? Too? <laughs> Nothing. We did meet with Holiday. Um, there, there was very little good about him. Even his whiskey was terrible. Uh, so, um, thank you, thank you for the upgrade of the whiskey. What you brought booze to this guy? Well, I can't buy alcohol because that's wrong. But there was some that's... on the counter. That's so genius, giving him drinks while he's already at the you lowest took... of his life. I mean, no. you all can be inducted into my soul. Man, if you donate it to the investigation. But that was oh. the bottle that me and Penny were going to eat. Okay. I'll go get another So, one, Penny, the long and short of it is it you have, like, a rather persuasive you talk to uh, Professor Heisenberg, chemistry teacher, but it's late, and, uh, you know, he... he he doesn't usually care about the school paper this much. He sort of is a hands-off kind of guy. You know, he sort of got shuffled off to this per uh, particular job. Uh, it's his turn. You know, he pissed somebody off. So you're surprised. And he says, well, look, uh, I got to tell you, you know, this is kind of weird. The cops are saying this guy, you know, uh, uh, this fuck. I don't know. I wasn't aware of this guy, Sanders. He showed up dead. Then this uh, castle. He disappeared, and now, now they're saying they found a, a, you know, another dead faculty member. I mean, I guess I, I don't think I'm next or anything, but the cops, I think this is just random stuff. Uh, Clay, Clay, he's new here. Boom, gone, whacked. But then he didn't say whack. He's in. He's a, he's a chemistry professor. Uh, uh, are you know, sure he should he, be phoning the police? Like this sounds like something they need to deal with, Prof. No, they, they called me. They called me, and I think we should get out there and. Uh, investigate you know like first thing tomorrow is what i'm saying we might actually get something done and we, we might actually break a story i you know like this is kind of interesting even for me should be I will, i'll get right you on it really care about this. what's the matter with you <laughs> what's that Absol i'll get right on it absolutely this would be all a right, hell of a story right. okay faculty all right, being well, murdered around the campus as long as you're no yeah, hopefully crazy, you're not one right. of them because i like you oh yeah well you know i have a bunsen burner to fight them off okay good yeah Maybe you should spend some time in your RV. I don't know what sure a professor. <laughs> I don't know what a chemistry chemistry professor would say. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, H two O, got it. And uh, over and out. H two O. H two O. Yeah. <laughs> Folks are gonna see you later. <laughs> Sometimes my Walk. role playing is garbage. Walks in. Hey, yeah. sorry, just had a student. You know, reporting issue had to deal with no problem. That's been done. Yeah, yeah, Where are we at with the whole but, murdering track. people? Booty call. Yes. Question mark. I, no. Okay. It's no. You are I'm in the group call. chat, Chuck. No. <laughs> okay. No. You all know that I took sobriety very seriously and everything. But tell me all about how how holidays alcoholism wrecked in his life. I just I just think that so everyone deserves sobriety, but you know, from what Chuck's telling me, I hope this guy. Well, if you would like a direct have list you, of observation, his holiday. eyes were yellowed and jaundiced. His speech was slurred. He did seem to have not bathed in several days. Oh, and he oh. displayed a distinct despair of those who no longer care about life. And oh. you believe his information is no accurate? No, no, absolutely not. The guy is a psychopath. But in all fairness, his brain was broken by the fact he's been introduced, you know, out of the blue to people like, you know, oh, this could do this real wacky stuff. <sighs> and he just had one of his clients have their daughter kidnapped right in front of his face. So in all fairness to the guy, he's gone, he's gone for a no, lot. Well, oh. he, he, he sees us now. He, he's 
So, even um, from what I can figure oh. out, because he he was he was off his face, um, the he can he was given something from the person at the at the carnival who who murdered Goldie and tried to murder us, or tried to murder me at least, and a few others, um, and that allows him to see. Like that allows him to see what we do, but he do, but he doesn't want to see what we can do. Like he can see everything now, and that's why I it's think like, he drinks so much. It's his camera, isn't it? Yeah. Like when we first when we first met him, when, and uh, yeah, the thing you mentioned his camera. So, Sammy Sammy said it was his, that the, the camera is what gives him that power. But um, hmm. so I was thinking, if we stole the camera, we could help him out by not like. By removing that effect, but he doesn't have his camera on him all the time, and he can still see that. Hmm. Oh, so well, I think he's a bit probably, further gone. Well, that probably means that he's just like us, or at least he's pretty much waking up to it. I mean, when I first found the wand, it was basically like that until I blew yeah. the first bubble. I had no idea what I was doing. So to give, give him some credit, he's in a really bad space right now. Really, we should be helping him. Well. That's what I've been trying to do, and he keeps on sending us into danger. So, mm. like, send him to rehab or something? I, I think they'd most likely lock him up in the asylum. The what last, he would say oh. to them. The last time we did the whole rehab, well, Maeve didn't go through a very good time with that. Oh, Maeve, you're in your sobriety? Like with, with the pa no, not, not, not that good type of rehab, but, like, oh, talking okay. about... Power, like that powers and psychologists and stuff and like that got really weird and really dark and that was like that I've... weird chicken the asylum that was not rehab that's therapy well that's what i said yeah. oh. and they and they were really rehab. cruel and i thought i was the one okay. that doesn't focus that, okay that... godless there is actually a missing child missing yes, child quite... missing child yeah absolutely right right all right right so right now you were saying that there's a missing child so from the data you gather alex what do you think we should do at, at holiday and his rather drunken state mentioned that perhaps if one could um part the veil that that hides our powers in some way <clears throat> she looks at mave they look at mave like oh. um it, it might be able to um track the rattle the child had it it, it has relic abilities whatever a relic is yeah the, um holiday right. said that the kid made the fire dragon not and surprised. rafe said that it was most likely an item not a person who caused the dragon if i remember she wanted to that. kill the person didn't she to stop them from no. doing it again i stopped them yeah the person she wanted to it does seem a rather dangerous relic. item to leave in the control of a small child yeah. i mean yeah. I, it, it can, it's the like, child can't have so... done it on purpose it's Listen, kid. it's just so irresponsible the for world-changing power away. to be given to people who doesn't have the processing cap capability or responsibility to use it. Okay, so uh, we can track the relic, maybe. That sounds like a great first yes. step. Let's try that. Mm -hmm. You want me to track the child? The, ra the, the, the rattle. The rattle is easier to track than the child, because the rattle had power. So if you can track the rattle... You've been... Doing that thing where you look at us and you see things. Hmm. Perhaps yeah, that but ability. That's like yeah. You guys, I've never but... done it like citywide. Like, I'm not a hound dog. You can do also, it. Also, we're standing right in front of her. Of course she can see. There's limitations. Davis, when you say you're not a hound dog, no, you hear no, a little some no. music. No. And no. you look around and there's a clown saying, I think you are. Okay. <laughs> You know what? You know what? You know what? I want to find out what this clown is. I want to. Can I investigate this clown, Polly? Well, currently he's wearing an Elvis Presley outfit, so guess well, what? Let me just tell. Okay, so like, um, invest. Well, I'll let you investigate the clown. No, you don't, have, clown, to, you don't have to let me investigate the clown well, if you don't want to. Well, well, I just want to just, you know, I just want to give you like a little bit of a, you know, information that 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 there's something still going on there. Like, it's probably not really invest it's it's not going to be something unless it's like a very simple question you know like what's going on you know what i mean it's 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 something that you know you might have to work on over time 
But but I'll let you roll investigate if you would like to, because there, there could be some fun result. <sighs> no, it's fine. I'll wait, because I have to investigate something else anyways, because apparently I'm a hound dog. And then I now, just, I'll look at the clown and be like, shut up. If you could try. He is wearing an Elvis uh, costume work. as well. Oh, good. Even good. worse. And he does like the, like the you know, the action. Um, well, um, so, do... wait, wait, wait. One more thing. One more thing. Uh, Penny, without, at a risk of putting too fine a point on this particular point, did you recognize the name of the first professor that showed up dead? Dr. Sanders? No. What wasn't that the name of <laughs> Well then, as you were. Wait, no, wasn't Dr. Sanders the um psychology professor, the one that like I did therapy? Anthropology. With? Oh, anthropology? What? Yeah. What? He was a professor. Uh, okay, I don't all right, I am very confused. So I'm going to stick to what I know. And what I know is that Holiday knows something about where that little girl went. And he can't remember it right now due to his alcoholism. So the answer is to send him to rehab and then we can get him information when he's sober I, in his recovery. I don't think we have that much time. Are we still on a clock? 48 hours. Could, could, you, could you try? And Who's look the out the window girl? and just see. Like, could you give it a go, honestly? Because maybe it will work, maybe it won't. I don't know. Oh, I mean, I as long as it doesn't what? put, as long as you don't have too much of a desire to, you know, express your power and, you know, as long as it doesn't stress you too much. You know what I'm saying? I think you're talking about Drew Langstone, Doctor Drew Langstone. Uh, yeah, uh, that was a therapy guy. Dave. Yeah. Oh, Actually, okay. though, that there's another person beside Holiday who witnessed the thing that happened with the kidnapping. From what you're telling me, it's her did, dad. Duh. Did Sammy, and I don't think Moonwraith wouldn't have kidnapped a kid. What she wanted was to collect the relics to take them away from people so that they couldn't use them to develop the elixir of immortality. Which, Moonwraith may have a fair. better idea. Who? Sorry, Cameron. Well, it's not an elixir. Do you need the template? I, to be fair, I also think that she is searching for the elixir of immortality. So maybe she does have ulterior motives, just like the rest of us. But I don't think, <laughs> I don't think that she is like. At least I didn't get that she was being malicious about it. I don't suppose so you happen to get her like number, that, did you? Because it'd be point. quite useful to um to ask. Moonlight, if moon, because if sorry, if, Rafe, uh, Rafe. Moon Rafe, yeah, that's the one to ask her about more about it because it seems like she understands more about this than we do. And we know that Sammy's boss was threatening him. Uh, so not Sammy, what was his name again? Oh, it was Sammy, yeah. Sammy's <laughs> boss was threatening him, and he's most likely the his boss is the person who's taken his kid. So maybe they know something, maybe she knows something about Sammy. I don't know. Know, well, does anyone has that either. deal phone number? I Daddy, I like don't... to find. Daddy, I'd like to find. <laughs> I don't think that's what that means, Christine. Um, but no. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't have Sammy's number. I don't have Moonray's number either. I'd have to track her down. So, like, do you want me to track down the Rattle or Moonwraith? What's more important to you guys? The Rattle, honestly, I feel like. We're concerned about Moonray's agenda than going directly to the relic might prove less problematic. Okay. Um, also, hopefully they were kind enough and let the kid keep the rail. Maybe they don't know what it is. I don't know. Unless if we go to Moonray and then we convince her that the people who kidnapped the child is trying to use the relic and then we get her helping us. Well, I still don't know who she is. the one who but... kidnapped the child. Well, then we're just Ask her nicely. To then at least we'll know when she tries to kill us, right? I don't think she'll try to kill us. Find she... the child and not trust the shady woman. Well, I mean, if we didn't trust the shady woman, then like, you know. Anyways, um, 
I'm opens gonna, up the curtain slowly. <laughs> I'm gonna, uh, yeah, I'm gonna like roll investigate and see if I can look through the mist to somehow track down this girl. I don't know what I'm doing, Holly. You can tell me if this is impossible. Okay, roll <laughs> see through the mist. Uh, okay. You 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 have to add the, your number of mist. I think mist themes. So that my mythos themes, so two. Yeah, it would be roll plus two. I don't think there's a move for this in the book. Uh, in there the... isn't. Oh no, 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 no! It yeah. would just be investigate on roll twenty. Okay, so I'm just rolling to see through the mist. Yeah. Okay, and then plus two. Yeah. I can't add any other tags, but it's just plus my mythos. Uh, yes, okay. yeah. I mean, if there's any statuses, uh, those would apply. But I think otherwise it's just plus two. Healed one. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> nope, sorry. Um, I know, I know, I know. I'm just gonna keep saying it until it eventually applies. Um, I do have um I can I do have the improvement that allows me to see through the mist, right? Which is does that help at all? Or is that yeah. uh that's that's not gonna give you a mechanical advantage on this specific one. There's okay. a different other uh <laughs> there's a different other veteran upgrade that'll give you a plus three on every see through the mist roll. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, I'll just roll this with a power of two. Okay. Um, where the heck is, okay, investigation. Oh, not even that bad. I was expecting a zero. Okay, so you had a mixed success. You can spend uh, clues one for one to ask me a question about the subject of your investigation. I can introduce one complication and I will decide what it is and hopefully not forget. I've been forgetting lately to introduce complications. So soft successes have made their way into being hard successes, but I will try to think of a complication. You could also just ask me questions because I'm kind of putting myself out here. So I don't mind questions. Oh, I know, but sometimes um, I forget to do that even. Someone um, else is looking as well. <laughs> you could also give me a part true, part false answer, you know, um, or fuzzy I incomplete. Could. Anyways, I could. Um, but what, so what, where would someone possibly? Anyway, let's see. What? Go ahead. Or, or you can do reverse clues. Called? Don't forget. Oh, okay. Um, reverse clues are available to you. I, I think I, I think I want to ask a question and then I'll do a reverse okay. clue if I do okay. my second question. So where is the rattle? There it it, it uh. It was originally, you know, so you look through the mist and you see symbols and, and, and you see feelings and you see uh, a little violin playing, small violin. You hear a, uh, a you know, a little blanging of a, of a, of a, of a, of a kind of a bell or type of, of a, you know, like a ship, you know, can you hear that? Uh, and then, you know, that clears up. And you see that the uh, uh, the rattle has traveled through a circuitous path. Um, there is a story, a, you know, a a legendary story behind the rattle, but it hasn't always been with the rattle. It, it used to be a, a a a person, but whatever essence is now, you know, has been reduced the rattle. But even then, the rattle is on the move. You see that. Uh, you sort of flash back in your mind's eye to when the you know child holds the rattle. You see the little dragon on it. It uh, it glows within a a, a, a bright you know uh, uh, mythic energy, and it travels throughout the city. It it's taken violently, and you get a sense that 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 those who who kidnapped the daughter were afraid themselves to touch it. It might be that the daughter just, you know, happens to be the safest place for it at any time. But it eventually, through, uh, through, you know, it, it, you don't know, let me see if I can describe it. So the rattle started out in Chinatown and then it wandered over in your mind's eye to the old quarter, kind of near the university not exactly next to, not exactly in the historical society, but there and around, you know, it's near, near the campus grounds, but somewhere in the, you know, general area of the historical society. Uh, and then it stayed there for a while. You mark in your mind's eye that place so you could go there if you wanted to. 
you feel that there's something there, but subsequent to that, because you are patient with it for once, the clown says to you, keep, keep looking, don't phase out yet. You see the rattle travel and it, it, it's, it stays in the old quarter, but disappears under the depths of the Valerian, uh, the Valerian, what is it called again? Arts and something or other. God damn it, I had it right oh. on the page and then I moved it. Yeah, the oddities. Valerian's yeah. oddities and curiosity. Oh, yeah. And you see it fall down and disappear. And then you come back out of it. No, I'm clowns. still looking for stuff, but yeah, I do appreciate That's, the. You can thank me later. <laughs> <laughs> um uh can i i want to try to see um since i do want to speak to moonwraith um i just uh i i wanted to see if i could use like a reverse clue to say that she's actually there and as well or she's like in that area as well like when okay. i'm looking through the mist i see that uh you know she is like within the area i don't know if she's in the building but she's definitely around it Okay. All right. So she is around Valerian or the mysterious area where the where the rattle paused for some time. Which one would you like? I'm going to let you decide where she may be found. She could be found around uh, Valerian's because that's where we think that the, I have the sleeves. That's where I think the rattle. Here's what I'm going to so. do. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do the complication where she might be in one of those other uh, one or the other. You you can't you don't you can't tell for sure. Which one it is? Okay, um, I will snap out. Uh, like the the um, you know, my eyes are like glowing this bright pinky purple um, as I'm like scanning through the city, um, and then like you know, I snap back and I just take like a, and like the you know the color fades from my eyes and I kind of look at everyone and I go, uh, okay, um, trying not to give the same reaction that I did the last time, but that was cool. Uh, I just, <laughs> I just feel like everyone should know that that was better than anything that's ever happened in my life. And I'm pretty sure I'll never experience anything like that again. Um, I um, look to Penny and I oh say, my. ouch. <laughs> wow. Oh, I mean, that's a different kind of good. Ooh. This is, this is, this is like spiritual. Like, oh, whew. wow. Um, uh, so it didn't it didn't pull on your group you know, chat. Hence the, hence the, the booty right? call. Oof. Sorry, what did it did it what? Sorry, it, 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 I, <laughs> you, you don't feel a, a certain lust for a great power or anything. Do you feel more like yourself? So, anyways, I found the. Uh, I think I found uh. the rattle is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but we're talking about this. Okay, <laughs> cute. Where is it? Um, so I'm pretty sure the rattle vanished underneath Valerian's, um, that oddity shop. Um, I kind of saw it, like, almost falling into some kind of abyss, so I assume there's some kind of, like, magical barrier blocking me from seeing exactly where it is. I get the feeling that they took Sammy's daughter because Sammy's daughter is the best containment unit for the rattle. I think none of them want to touch it because they're afraid of it. It kind of makes me wonder what would happen if someone else tried to use my wand. I don't want to try it, um, obviously, for, you know, uh, reasons, not because I don't want anyone else to touch it. Um, but I, uh, <laughs> but I, don't write that down. Stop writing. Alex, <laughs> I think, I think maybe she was the most safe protection for it to like not make it go off or do something crazy. Maybe, I don't know. But um, I think I know that Moonwraith is either, she's either at Valerian's or she's at this place that I saw the rattle before. Um, but I'm not quite sure which one she's at. Um, so we could go to Valerian's, but she might not be there. Um, yeah, that's all I saw. Oh, and I also saw that, um, no, I didn't say anything else. I was going to come up with a funny joke, but no. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Well, if we split up into two groups, we can travel through my picture, and then we can just reconvene when we find Moon. No, yeah, but no splitting up split apart up again. Find me. I, I like I like being together as well. Someone dies. 
no dying. Yeah. I don't yeah, think I any agree. of us are going to die. Again. 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 Oh, yeah, you two both. Sorry. Anyway, um, yes, let's anyway. try and save this kid. Um, right. So, we're going Valeria's to travel. Is that the one that was. Carry on. Yeah, we're going to travel as a group. We're not going to split up anymore. No more. Uh, There's splitting up and doing our own thing crap. We have proven that we cannot stick to a plan, even though it was agreed up beforehand. Not naming any names. <coughs> Kill. We came back with all the information we were asked for. Not oh, you guys. oh, it's, it's no. not. It's not us. I did too. Not... Hey, hey, Alex, Alex, not for you. You're good. You're fine. Um, yeah, I... <laughs> be, uh, be... <laughs> Who are you talking about? Like no one. It's fine. It was my fault. I messed so up. Should I call oh, okay. a cab to so, get to the oddities? I was just making sure it wasn't else. me. Cool. Can we get a coffee break before we do that? Or... <gasps> yeah, we got. We got five minutes. Yeah. It's like oh, what yeah. empty. Yeah. Actually, yeah. though, yeah, but we're going. Let we can't wait. Wait, does that mean I can still oh. make the party? I want a croissant. Let me uh, let me ask you a question. I believe it. Uh, you've had a very stressful day. I am. I I would consider if you if you think you want to go out tonight. I think that if you know it's going to be you're going to be very fatigued. Your judgment might be might be impaired. I think I might give the party a, a fatigued one if you try to do something else tonight. I, I I don't think we can wait. This is a kid. Okay, I don't listen, think we have the option to wait. Let's go, go to Celestial Buck. Of one. Let's go to Celestial Buck and get some frappuccino. Okay, but like, hear me out. I did just exert like a lot of power twice in one night, and I am really like feeling the fatigue like i i would like to sleep not that i want to you know push you beyond your limits but there there is valuable data to be had in pursuing just how deep in the fatigue we can still function i i'm a kid There's like a when kid i hit a sweet spot one is group, like group, oh maybe we could do it you know like group, uh, group chat it's only one um, <laughs> chuck types into the group chat um, is she rolling over and going to sleep? Is that what Maeve just said? Chuck, why are you typing in a group chat? We're all sitting right in front of each other. Maybe. <laughs> I text back. Honestly, to... honestly, I prefer chatting than talking. It's nice, yeah. Uh, I, I think we should go. It's like, it's it's a kid. Yeah, okay, but, but you, you have exerted yourself a lot. And we shouldn't push you, and I agree that we definitely shouldn't, because you've done a lot already. But we do need to try and at least find the location of this kid, and we can report it oh. to the authorities or do something else. What is it she take a power nap in the car? The moon is very large tonight, so you're going to have more light, although the skies are, as always, overcast. Wait, Fine. hold on a sec. Maybe she could mark it on a map and then take a nap here while the rest of us go. Can hey, we stop what time talking is it? about like I'm not right in front of everyone? Like, I'm reading these text messages in front of you all. Like, LMAO. Make, it, make another group Maeve, chat. Maeve, stop you reading group me. chat. Pog. They're writing the same room. <laughs> LMAO. L. There's an emoji after each of my words. I so if I call the cab. No, okay. I'll just, we can just, why don't we just picture travel? Like, that seems like the fastest way. Do we have, like, pictures of Chinatown? Uh, probably not. Um, I, I haven't taken any of that recently. But we're not going to Chinatown, probably... are we? No, that's where the Valerian said oddities, old quarter. I believe. Oh, Valerian's in the old quarter. quarter. Right. Ah. What was the, what was the one in Chinatown? Chinatown. Chinatown. I live in the old quarter. I was, no, no. There was, a, there, was a, uh, there was a shop. I live in downtown. downtown. I do, yeah. I was like, I live in the old quarter. No. <laughs> they are contained within our district. It, chances are that um, manual travel you did notice... just as fast. Sorry, sorry. Uh, I didn't mean to interrupt. Uh, no, what ahead. did we notice? Um, I did I didn't mean to remind you. I should have told you when you went into your headquarters slash apartment, there was a little notice on the door saying that the water will be off tomorrow for maintenance. Yeah. I don't know. Okay. I don't know why that's important. 
Oh. That is, I it's just normal your, stuff. I hate uh, you on your th- self, See, this is why I hate <laughs> apartment. Maeve, like I said, we should have moved our headquarters into our office. Oh, moves are fun. Yeah, why don't we move headquarters out of my apartment? Okay, well, the old quarters right. right next to the university, I so we can just put the power over there and put it in my room. Like, how about we combine our powers and buy our own apartment block? As did, he, did you? And Chuck looks to to Christine and Maeve. Yeah, the only the only two people of actual <laughs> money in the group. Our collective powers, <laughs> yeah. My parents um, are not buying an apartment block for my friends. They no barely... for your super group. I mean, past data would suggest that they'd just be excited you had friends. I'm finding Listen. a photo of the university Whoa, campus. Oh, wow. wow. I hold on. I have friends. Maeve is pretty cool. Hello, taxi. Can you pick us up for the university car park, please? Thank you. We've just been going a short while. <laughs> All right, I'm going to get the party for T1. <laughs> what I time is it? Friends. <laughs> Wait, what time is it? Round 10. Oh. MG, you guys, it's 10. I need my beauty now. No, 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 no. You were just, you were just saying just wear more we makeup. Just get coffee. It'll be fine. You're, we're all going. We're all going to suffer now. <laughs> it's it's a kid, wait. guys. We can't not kid. go. Mm. Yes, but it's, it's you years shut of your skin. Fucking... <laughs> it, is, it is years of skin, people. I my career depends that... on it. It's way more makeup. Given the track record, once Penny decides we're doing something, we are doing it. Can we, we have at least I know, that's exactly how I felt the other bar. night. Can okay, we at least okay. swing by the Celestial <laughs> Park, get some Frappuccino or something? Please, yes, we, we, abso- we absolutely can do that. Just get it delivered to the University <laughs> Car Park. Phone up a takeaway go. service. Get it done right now. We'll pick it up when we go there. Then we'll get in the taxi and we're going to go <sighs> save a child. Do you, <laughs> do you are taking the cab. Do you have the Bloober Eats? <laughs> Up on your focus. Oh my god, we're going. We, we no more. We just we're going to. The, we're going already. Well, we got fifty minutes left for the taxi to show up anyway. So. Where would you like to go? University car park. I would undoubtedly have many photos of such a place. Are you in the university? Oh, yeah. Okay. Mm, okay. Right next to okay. And is that where? How do you get to? Where are you going to go from there? I just want to skip to the like in the you know the next scene. Yeah. I, um, that's I a good question. The Penny's, Penny's pulling shop? us through a photo to the parking lot of the university, and then we're going to take okay. a cab from there to Valerian's. All right. Okay. So you do all that, and and the and <laughs> the uh, the what's that? I was just going to say that oh. way, no one knows where our secret hideout is. Oh. Yeah. Also, so, that. Um, yeah. If they didn't see the secret HQ on top of my door, they would not have no idea. And the one you guys put in my window. That was me. Oh, the the LED yeah. sign's coming soon too. But they, they might just forget. Oh, did we order so that one already? <laughs> yeah, I have the logo now. Th- thank, thanks for the um for the credit card. Whose credit card? Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Alex gave it to me. Would you got it? I actually took the liberty of um, taking out a corporate credit card in our um, our, our detective <laughs> corporate agency. Corporate credit card. Whose who's did... credit did you what? use? Important. But no, whose what? social did you use? It's not important. Opening the important picture. Hold my what's hand. the name of the What's the name of the organization? That's the we're important gonna, part. We're gonna Listen, talk about if, this. If it just credit. pain punishes. <laughs> Listen, just let me know so I so I remember to pay it. Otherwise, I forgot and maxed it out. It's already been forwarded to your accountant. Don't worry about it. Oh, oh, it's which crazy. accountant am I using now? Crazy. Uh, it was short sell Alf. This Frappuccino is hidden. Yeah, this oh, is look, great. the taxi's here. <laughs> All right, so you get in the taxi. You make your, you know, you know, it's a, it's a. It's a short drive over to Valerian's Oddities and Curiosities. It's not immediately uh, on the street. Is that where we're going, or we're going to the other one? Valerian's no, Oddities Valerian. and Curiosities. Okay. And uh, 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 the taxi driver stops, and, and uh, you know, it's not in the street, but, but you do know, because the driver knows, uh, somehow you know, because you you just did a search, and... and and you make your way 
you have to go through an alleyway. It's not immediately right in front of there. You have to, uh, the drive there and then sort of walking through an alley. You just have, you have to go through like a, a like layers of construction in the old quarter. There's some, you know, they're building things here. Uh, you finally see after, after what seems to be a, a bunch of turns uh, through a couple of alleyways. It's not just straight to this sort of, I know it seems more circuitous than it should be. Maybe it's the construction or something like that. Uh, there's, there's like, you know, this fire escapes. The rain has started to drizzle, and and you can see the drops of water falling. You can hear the 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 uh, you know the noise as 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 the uh, water falls from the fire escapes to the ground. You make your way then and see a quaint door uh, with painted lettering on it, and it has a, a neon sign, Z Valerian and Valerian's oddities and curiosities. 24 hours. Good thing that uh, you checked ahead of time and saw that it was 24 hours open. You go in and it is, well, you're immediately surprised at what you see. Uh, the It didn't look like much. It looked like it was kind of a small hole in the wall in the middle of a, you know, sea of construction and an industrial maze, well, not industrial, a old quarter maze of construction if you will, but inside it's surprisingly voluminous, but still not spacious because it's packed from the floor to the ceiling with books, trinkets, archeological artifacts, you think, uh, anthropological artifacts as well. There is a, uh, when you see your, your attention is immediately uh, grabbed by a old, an old man, with a tweed jacket. Oh, uh, well, he's a, oh, well, welcome. He, he seems like a kindly old <laughs> fellow, uh, you know, who uh, likes to collect things. He's, you know, he sort of looks like the exact guy you would expect in a store like this. Uh, and uh, <clears throat> welcome to uh, Valerian, you know, hey, come on in, but just be careful before you, you, you like look around for just a second, you see, yeah, it's kind of weird. Like there's a, it's it's there's there's like bookcases, shelves, aisles, but but there doesn't. You don't immediately catch any sort of order. It looks like it might be a little bit of a maze in there too. He says, "Yeah, yeah, you know, I see what you're looking at. Uh, one could get lost down there." He warns you. Um, <clears throat> he's a bee bee speckled man in a tweed vest. Sorry, I said tweed jacket. I meant vest. Uh, he says, you know, this is how you uh, uh, get get to the, you know, you know, he points to like the main way to go to like, you know, into the store. Uh, let's see what else. He, he, and he says, you better take a light with you. And he he holds out a flashlight. Uh, also, you know, a, I could probably, well, I can't really help you find anything. You, This is sort of the store where sometimes things call out to you, but, uh, you know, there might be, well, I often feel like sometimes people like to want to have a little bit of candy in their way, you, you know, when they come in. I, I like that. And you can see that there's a, 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 uh, a bowl of just, you know, it looks like just regular, like hard candies, uh, blue and white color, or, or sorry, blue and red color candies in this, in this glass jar. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I wouldn't actually do that. But uh, I thank you, sir. <laughs> do you have a map? Yeah, well, you know, it's yeah. I like to have a little tasty treat when I do a little shopping. Sometimes that's what all. was your name again, sir? Sorry, <laughs> I didn't catch it. Oh, me. Yeah. My yeah. name is. Uh, my name is. Um. <laughs> my name is. What. Uh, Hold on a second. Let me think. Of it. Let me think. I, Alfred or something. I gotta think. Of something like that. Yeah. Uh, uh, what's that? My name is Alfred. <laughs> That's right. Alfred. Quarter duck. Uh, are, are those authentic, Alfred? Are those authentic? Alfred. Susie Alfred. Tribal okay. masks. Is that, um, is that a Nordic? Everything death here is sphere? authentic. And, uh, I, I, where did I you would. 
I see is that, we is have that a, a, is that a lantern of divine light? When, where did you acquire these things? Um, oh, sorry, I but... don't do the. I am not. Oh, if only I was the one who was responsible for some of these treasures. I am. I am. I am not. I'm merely the. Uh, I. I'm merely the uh, attendant here, to allow people in to discover what great treasures have been found and put behind. Put it put here in the store, and I am so excited to meet somebody who is just as excited as me at the wonderful things that you can find in this world. Am I right, Alfred? You and documents. Yes. You have documents. Yeah. Can we take anything out that we find, or do we have to oh, leave it when we find it? Oh, you, you see, the answer is yes yes if if the item allows you to you see some to some of these items they they select you right um great i would like to you... investigate this man <laughs> possibly <laughs> vague man you are alfred well i I don't really have a lot of information from you. You can roll investigate. I'm a kindly old man. You know what I would like is what I would suggest is you venture into the store and see the wondrous yeah, treasures maybe, that are maybe there. I want to investigate the store itself mystically rather than investigate. I'll let you roll investigate. Yeah. Or, uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Well, would, we, uh, okay, go, go ahead. Tell me what you want to do. I just want to investigate the store to see if I can find, like, to if my misty powers allow me to, like, see something off or, like, to understand maybe what... This is obviously, like, some kind of magical place. So, yeah, well, I'll give especially... you this for free. Okay. Here, I'll give this for free. There's a way to deal with this. Um, if you would like to venture into the store, into the depths of the store, you have to roll a... Change the game. Before uh, we do yeah. that, can we check yeah. if Moon... Oh, can, can Chuck check? If Moonwraith is nearby. Why is Chuck checking? Because he's got the... Oh, the x-ray vision. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. I, I, also, what? Chuck, don't, don't show him that mask. Like, try to keep it, you know, to yourself. Yeah, maybe just walk out the store for a sec and come back in. What? He's a Could you check collector. if Moonwraith is, like... Do not show the like... mask to him. Are you guys whispering in front of him, or are you text? No, no. This is why we have group chat. I put into group chat. <laughs> we're, we're like five feet. We're five. <laughs> like, All right. It just have a look I'll, around. I'll Maybe where the murder where the, the moon shopkeeper is. with a million questions. About I'll just. Items. I mean, I, I think you're already doing easier. that. I feel like I don't think that's a distraction. You're already the moment we walked away. You're already immediately on him. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. I'll just send a text and be like, don't show him your relic. Chuck. The mask. No idea what a, you're a talking about. Quick... The mask. <laughs> on your face. Your glasses. Just hide your glasses. Then I can't see. Well, then we'll guide you. Just don't put them on. Let's just take five, head outside, have a look around just... very quickly, and then come back. Oh my god, we can, just to make we sure Moonwraith's right. We could have flashbacked or whatever. I don't care. I just wanted to say that if Chuck doesn't understand, that's fine. I'm not going to get my relic stolen. Um, Chuck gets his. That's not my problem. Okay, um, sir. Um, is that a basement? I'm feeling a call from the basement. Well, I. Basement is a word that's used for. Store is not like this one. So you could say there's a basement here, of course. I, I, I'm sure if you wanted to, you could find it. H however, the way that this works is you're going to have to roll and change the game. And you can choose how deep into the store you want to go. You see, you could choose up to one, two, three, or four. And uh, if you achieve a successful change the game, you get to go that deep into the store. Four, you might find this basement of yours. You know, I, I don't I don't really know. Now I do caution you. I do you could probably tell by looking in here. Sometimes it takes a while for folks to find their way out. You know what I mean? They get sort of interested in all the treasures. And you know, sometimes every once in a while, 
every once in a while, uh, folks don't come back at all. Why would you tell um, us this? Are there Honest people living in the store? Have you yeah, ever been to like a lawsuit? Why would I tell? Be, be, I'm just warning you. There's. Uh, why would I not tell you? Pockets of space? I'm a nice guy. When, are you I'm merging sorry. dimensions? How, do you, how are you doing okay. it? Oh, I Maybe. I just work here. Uh, I don't, you know, the I enjoy just being mm -hmm. amongst some of the most uh, fabulous and well. I think it doesn't. It, it, it's not too too uh, too too strong to say powerful items that I I think exist. You know, <laughs> this do is the a, items this get is, more rare. The deeper you go, they do. Oh, the stories I have heard of what people have found. We don't have an inventory, you know. I don't. I don't know what's there. I wish I did. Wow. I think. I think the person. Are you hiring? Who... I was happily oh, inventory the story you know, for you. You know, you would have Last to day. talk to my boss on that one. Have you designed the store, okay. like here? Okay, me. Th mm. Even they have arrows though now. I never heard of. I, I am an old man, and Very I happy don't to buy talk to your boss. cheap furniture. In fact, can I go uh, further in the I, store? All the stuff I, I, I bought. I'm walking out the. I'm walking out the door and shouting, "Moon Rafe as loud Alex. as I can at this point, because before we go My deep, we're going to have a look at Moon Rafe's near here. For God's sake, <laughs> <laughs> are we slating the party? I mean, where, where, where does, where does it look like the rattles at? I don't know. I'm like. Roll investigate to see if Moonwraith is here, or I mean, I guess by process of elimination, if it turns out Moonwraith is not here, Moonwraith, uh, you'll know where she is. Right? How does that work? If she's not here, she could we know where she is? Yeah, we, yeah she's not because, here, we the other because I gave you one or the other. Okay, yeah. there's two options. That's the complication, yeah. Mm -hmm. Want to get flat? Success. Come on, success. All right, there you go. Well, uh, I don't know why your friend just yelled some name here. We haven't seen, you know, it's kind of late. There's not people being hanging around at all. It turns out uh, Moonwraith does not answer. You're convinced. Uh, well, hold on a second because <laughs> because this is a <laughs> uh, Here's what I'll say to you. You know, I haven't I haven't seen anybody around. It's pretty late. You know, this the, we're open 24 hours because you never know when somebody's going to need to enter the store and find out what's in there. Uh, but I got to tell you, I have, I can't tell you, I haven't seen anybody, certainly not a moon wraith or whatever that is. I, you know, that's, that's above my pay grade though, if you know what I mean. Right. Uh, you know, uh, so, so, uh, you, you youngsters want to go in my store or not here? Well, yeah. you know, I mean, you yeah, came they, a long I, way, they... I assume. Yes, please. I just have but one may last I, question. May I go? Oh, yeah. I, I don't mean to be the one stopping you. You know, the store uh, uh, calls different people for different reasons. That's why we stay open all the time. I, Alfred, I have one question. Um, yes, just one last yes. question. What do you guys mm -hmm. call the store? Not this store. What do you call? I mean, she like points towards like the entrance towards like the, the labyrinth area. What do you call that? What we what we call that the uh, well, we call that the the uh, the uh, the stacks. The stacks. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Did, really weird. Quite no, I probably stacks. doesn't. I... Mm. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. You can. Yeah, you yeah, can yeah, go yeah. ahead and yeah. ask me a question. If you, no, you know, no, that's fine. If you have the ability to see behind the mist, so maybe you could ask a question regarding that if you would like. I how don't much? Know. How much are things? They're free. I, he said they were free, basically. No, oh no, ones. no! I did not mean. Let's say price that tags. Free? That's oh okay. gosh, no! Oh, I'm I'm sorry if I suggested they're free. Everything, of course, has its price. Monetarily, they might be free. <laughs> this Funko, oh, I, you know, I I don't get involved in the accounting here. I, I just, you know, I'm just a, 
I'm just the uh, cashier, you know, store, store watcher, minding the store. That's my job. The greater. I'm afraid it seems like you're muted. Oh, Alex, it looks like you've muted yourself. Oh, you're not. Uh, they're not, they're not. No, oh. not again. Back. No, we can hear you. Hello? We hear you again now. There was, was I could hear you speak. Hooray. No, no, we just wasn't speaking. It wouldn't come through. Yeah. Are we going in the creepy guy's sex. store? Or... Alex, I think you should choose how deep you would like to go into the store. Oh. Uh, also, you know, down into four, the store. No, 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 no. no. I, I, I would, I, I would I see like the Maeve four. to say to Penny, "Hi, hey, listen, what's up? It, I think the store is going to bring us to places that we want to go, and not places that we should go. So we will come with you, but I think you should lead the charge and guide us through it because I don't trust." Alex to bring us to where we're supposed to go. Love you. Don't trust you. Mm -hmm. I don't trust any of us else to do it, and especially me to to go. Oh, you where don't we're trust anyone but go. Penny. I actually think you should lead the charge because the rattle contains great power, and I know for a fact you've got a bit of a an yeah, but inkling. There's probably for such a lot crazier things in there that I want more. Yeah, so... You laser focus on great power. Uh, they the should rattle. go first. Okay. You no, should no, go no, first, no. I Christine. Think, I think Penny's the only one I'm with the clear conscience and the heart of gold. And I go with and us. I go with Alex. Oh uh, Alex, you want to ask who the boss <laughs> is for the job? Are you there, All right, cool. Um, I'm. Uh, trying, and I go, we'll go with holding hands if need be. I am, of course. Don't leave me. Do we have <laughs> a rope? Don't kick with me. <laughs> <laughs> is anyone else going to check in? My Alex? tweet, my tweet touches on a, a hook. And I get, I'm <laughs> Who's up? on purpose? Well, or? which one of you young folks? I mean, I, I, I don't know if all of you want to go back or not. You know, uh, which one of you young folks are going to go into the store? I just like to, you know, keep track of who's in there. Do you have a guest book we need to sign or something? Oh no, nothing formal like that. I just am interested because I have to tell you to roll. Alex uh, and Chuck are headed, headed if you'll, deck. Yeah, I'll follow you then. <laughs> I feel like you'll get her okay. somehow. Okay. All right. All right. We should stick together. Let's go together. All right. Well, well like I, mean, I said... I'm going a different direction then, obviously, so... Oh, um, no. If, <laughs> if right. Maeve well, is planning to go a different way, direction... Here's the way that, you know, folks have do come into my store. Uh, they usually, you know... Some people want to go deep into the store, you know, down into the store. That's that's going to be uh, that's going to be four. You're going to have to roll, uh, you know, change the game at uh, minus four. You get that. But then you get you get to go real deep. Uh, there's three. There's two. And, uh, you know, that's determining how deep you go in the store. Uh, so, like, you could go in groups if 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 one or two of you want to go all the way down to, down into the deep store lost in the books if you will uh you can do that you know you got to roll individually but you know it's you get the same loss uh you get the same status you know as it were i, I don't know why i said that it's I, I, anyway you can go in groups to different depths is my point um can we use tags as we do this troll Oh, of course. Just like always, you know, this is this is just an ordinary store. There's nothing stopping you from using your tags. Shot <laughs> far be it for me to uh, police anybody's powers or whatever. I mean, in this place, I feel like you're gonna need you know your senses just to make your way back out. It's a mess back there. Alfred, um, do I put minus four? And then roll, change the game? Well, let me see. Let me just read this real quick. So venturing into the shop is a change the game move. This, uh, sorry, I'm reading this article right now out loud okay. for some reason. Uh, they, they can only be attempted once per scene. A PC, what the fuck is that? Is exploring <laughs> the clicked. shop. Chooses how deep she goes and receives a status to reflect this. Oh, I see, I see. So you get to choose one, two, three. You, you roll and change the game. If you succeed, you get the status. So it's not a minus four. If you choose to go deep in the basement, 
You just got to succeed and change the game. And then you get four as your status. Now, the problem is the deeper you go, the harder it will be to get out. So you'll receive a lost status, a tier greater than the one that you use to get your exploration. So, for example, if you get lost in the books at level four, you get you are hit with a, a status of lost five. However, however, you can face danger if you describe to the beautiful and hot MC how you avoid that Tesla? status. Oh. I really like the MC. It was written especially you, for Polly. I don't know why I said that. Yeah, you know, I'm reading that verbatim out of the book. It's okay. pretty good. Hey, hey boy, I'm book. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Maeve. Want to go together? Yeah, I mean, I am i don't know. I, I, if we, I don't think I trust Alex to go in the right direction. And I don't trust myself you pointed, either. But... You point the directions and I'll, and I'll find the ways. Okay, we can do that. And then a little bit of purple smoke on us. She said, you know, we should do this more often. Great team can be accomplished that way. And Patty, oh, okay, and there's no way in hell I'm leaving oh. you two. Oh, Excuse, yeah. like, no, you two Ooh. are like powder kegs in this place. Uh, hell oh no. I, I, I wasn't. Oh, you're you're thinking we're bad people. Okay, I was thinking. You know, okay, we're both in two different. It might be no, time. I, I, I know you both have an inkling of power you know, here. For a break. Yeah, yeah, we're halfway through the session. <laughs> I, you know, so you might want to think about it while we take our ten minute break, and I, you know. I gotta go, you know, I gotta make a pot of coffee because it's late. And so I'm gonna have to step away from the counter for a little bit. And, you know, if you wait, I'll come back. You can have a sip. Or right. also Ooh. help yourself to a bowl of the candy. Now, let me tell you this. I won't. The the, uh, well, before, before you say no, okay. you, you know, the candy flavors, they're two different colors, uh, but they taste even more different. Uh, well, maybe I you know what I'm why is one of Goodbye. them pussing? I got Why is it pussing? To the back room. What now? This has pus on it. What is that? Pus? Yes. Well, that's because I, uh, I what, what what has pus on it? The mints. Can you pus, see the pus. candy? Oh, fuzz. Yeah. Like it has fuzz on it. <laughs> it does. Yes. Oh well, that must be. You know, I I I don't buy the. You know, I they ship it. You know what? I. I have no idea. This is a bowl of candy. What do you want me to say? Hey, you know, I'm sorry if it's a little bit messy. You know, it doesn't, I assure you, it doesn't change the flavor. Uh, you should try one. I did. You did. Which one did, did you, uh, which one did you, uh, did you it take tastes the red like one a button. I won't or the you. blue? Did you, did you, uh, did you, did you, did you put a red one or a blue one in your mouth? Um, <laughs> I put a red one in my mouth. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I didn't swallow it, but it's there. <laughs> All right. So what I'm going to say is that that will take effect after. Are you going to venture in the store? I'm following Alex and John because um, I don't right, trust him. Well, you might not end up in the same place is what I'm saying. But oh. you'll have, you know, uh, your eyes will be open. You know, you sometimes you can't find your way out, but at least you'll have a delicious candy. Before we anyway, actually head into, head into the store, before we head into the store, before we take a break, yeah. can I do an actual roll? What would you like to do? Oh, investigate the candy. Roll dice? Yeah, an actual dice roll, yeah. I'd like All to right. investigate the candy. Go ahead and roll. Probably that not the best person to do it, but candy no one else is. Um, I've got reveal oh, enchantments, yeah. um, and it's all about physics, um, like understanding physics. I don't know if that's even going to be applicable or not, because this is all magic, but hey, this is, yeah, it's all I've got. Um, okay. <clears throat> and so I'm getting a plus one. How are I'm you? Using okay, a minus well, okay. So hold on a second. Fatigue. You didn't say what you did. You were gonna do I, to investigate. I, the I, I, I look at the candy and it's like, what are these candies? Are, are, if they're magical, then I can see that they're magical. That's what I want to see. And if there's any magical traces, anything, any essence that I can get from that, what the two color candies are, and whatnot. Okay. All right. Okay. That's okay. what I'm looking um, at. I'm looking at the like okay. the the structure of them and 
the magical or scientific structure of them. With reveal okay. enchantments, right? With the reveal enchantments and my understanding of physics and sciences and stuff and blah blah blah. Okay. Combining oh, the I two. Like because I like it. I'm a I'm a smart person. That Ooh, let's see so if we weird, can but... uh, invoke a weakness. Well, I'm already putting fatigue. That. If you don't want fatigue, I'll oh. take a weakness. Well, no, you're gonna get fatigued anyway. The oh, question is, try. are you gonna? Am I gonna invoke a weakness tag on you? I. Eh, I don't know. Forget it. I you will. can. You it's can. Too do complicated. Like. So I'm yeah, rolling flat. Roll. Mine's one. Oh, rolling flat. I see. Well, there you Ooh. go. It looks like you succeeded. You can ask oh me God. questions, or you can do a reverse clue. So, what does the candy do? Uh, so the candy is, well. Oh, do I have to ask which specifically which candy does? Uh, the blue, uh, the blue one. If you if you eat the candy, you, you will you will feel an intense desire to leave the store. And I'll give you a status, uh, you know, to leave the store. And, you know, that'll wear off after a while, but you won't be able to go back in because you do not want to be in the store. If you take the red candy or if you eat the red candy, you will uh, receive an additional loss to status on top of your previous the status that you took already because you're going deeper. Ooh. Uh. Ouch. Um, so I hand out the blue. The blue <laughs> hand yeah. out the blue. We, we, um, Got it. Hand out blue. It's like, look, I, I like the blue ones. Hey, I think we're changing, like, we'll take them later. Just leave them at the, like, take them later. You'll know when. Um, now, I think that if you, if you, if you take, I'll, I'll tell you this for free. Or, 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 yeah, 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 I'll tell you this for free. If you, if you, if you uh, took the red candy and you haven't gone into the store yet and you eat a blue candy, you will have the same same effect. You'll be you'll feel feel uh, uh, very uncomfortable. You don't like this. There's too much. This is too much information. You know, it's overwhelming and you feel an intense desire to lose leave the store uh, at, at that point. But once you go into the store, there's no blue candy going to save you. Yeah, so no one takes take one candy, right? So I, I took two, <laughs> the two different colors. Or, uh, well, you know, I, I mean, you're gonna miss out on the wonderful treasures in there. It's, it's just, you know, the candy just makes it more clear yeah. what you're looking for. And we'll head to a break, and unless someone else wants to do something, that was. Yeah, okay. Apparently, we're heading for a break. Okay, I just wanted to roll beforehand um, to, and yeah, clear thanks. things up before, because I can ask you questions in the break anyway. Um, so we're going to have a little break, stick around, we'll be back shortly, um, we'll be about only about 10 minutes, so um, if you're on YouTube, like, subscribe, all the bits and pieces, you won't even notice we're on a break, it'll be like 5-10 seconds for you. Otherwise, um, have patience and we'll be back shortly. So, see you soon. back so <sighs> should anything anything to say Karsh, or should we jump oh, right back ju in? just that i was just thinking on the break that um through all the discussion we've just had on the mechanics of this that my blue pill isn't going to help us 
um, and that I know where to um, take holiday. Yeah. <laughs> Jump into the bathroom in the Hold on. Door. Oh my. <laughs> okay. Oh, so funny. Alex, before you go, okay, before you go in, let's. No, no, I know, I know, I know, I know. I will come with you. I think, I think, it should just be me, Alex, and Penny that go in. Um, and I know that that I don't want to say why I think we should do those things. Um, well, for one, Kel, um, we might forget that you exist. And then what if we can't get you out and we forget uh, Two, uh, Chuck? I don't think you could get out. Um, <gasps> How dare you? And um, and three, Christine, I just I think you're too pretty to get lost. You know, like, I don't think you're I think you're too pretty to be on an Amber Alert. So I'm going to I'm going to just say it right there. I think you should maybe stay out here. And then, you know, I think you are more like rescue team for us. Right. So on, on one hand, that's so true. But on the other hand, I could get you all. I could get you all in so nope. many wonderful places. <laughs> and we're yep, going yep, to yep. have eternal Love fun. Love okay, that. that's Love creepy. That. I like so. fun. Let's keep. Let's I didn't keep like the, the way energy. you said that. I like fun. Oh. <laughs> let's let's keep the energy up here, uh, and you be the a the B team to rescue us because Alex, Alex, I get it. I see, I see you, I see you right there. Um, we're gonna go in the three of us because I think Penny can get us out at least um, with pictures, and I think one of us needs to monitor Alex because I don't think Alex is gonna want to leave. I'm gonna just do that soul read right there. So. Are you oh, sure I should be the part life of, of the child? Yes, are you sure I should be a Alex. part of the? Are you sure I should be a part of the rescue team? Yes. After all, I'm not very good at bringing people out as much as I am with bringing people in. Absolutely. Yeah. Yep. Uh, hundred percent. See all the deal. Rescue team <laughs> material, sis. Please, um, please. Love you. Please take my word for it that I need you here more than I need you in there. Okay. So are we, are we looking for the rattle specifically or are we looking for something else? I'm we gotta, I think we have to have a clear goal in mind when we go in. Yeah. yeah. Alex, are we looking for the rattle or are we looking for something else? We're looking for the rattle. Okay. I know, I know. Rattle. Roll your okay. eyes at me like you're a, to a toddler. I get it. I just... <laughs> All right. I trust you three. But remember, you can never delay being lost. <laughs> oh no! Oh, cute tweet. Uh, group chat goes through. Maybe... <laughs> Chuck, I don't think Christine is hot. I think Christine should stay up here with you guys. Goodbye. We're leaving. We're going down. <laughs> I'm. Okay, what do you What do you want us to roll to to explore? All right. Change uh, the game. Whoever's going to go in there, roll change the game. Now, before you do, you must tell me how deep into the stacks would you like to go? <laughs> how, how deep? I think it's going to oh, be four. Yeah, well, it's gonna there you four. go. Everybody is going to go as deep as possible into the store. Well, I am point. excited for you. I myself, I don't know that I've ever been that deep in the store. I, I, I'm an old man. I get lost real easy. So I, you brave youngsters, I cannot wait to hear your stories and what you find down there. Wow. Okay. Well, gee, you know, uh, uh, be careful though. You know, I, I don't need to tell you that, that the things down there, well, you know, they have a way of uh, answering your questions, of course, teaching you new things, uh, perhaps even coming back up with you. Uh, but, you know, everything, like I said before, has a price. And the further down you go, the higher the price is. I, I think you can imagine that. Well, anyway, have a great time. Um, you know, uh, here's our brochure. It doesn't really make any sense, but you know that this is so you can uh, remember uh, that this is the store that you're in, and then uh, hopefully, hope that there's some coupons. Connect to too. other stores. Oh, no, I, I don't know so that we don't about that. that. You know, the brochure. It, it it's just something we give everybody that goes in. That's all. Here you go. You each want take one now. Just like a regular brochure. It's it, it's got I coupons. Think it's 
it's supposed to be a reminder I, that we this we're not that we need to come back to the real uh, world. you know like it. we uh, you know it's just a, it's it's a way to just remind you that this is the place to come for uh, uh, the best artifacts and uh, you know uh, oddities that you might look for. We want your return service, so you know. Here you go. Hopefully, we will, we will return and we'll find out. Yes, but it doesn't confer any mechanical advantage to you, just so you know. Okay, I'll accept that it has no mechanical advantage, unless um, you know I, you want to make one out of it through the, uh, it through other methods. Why don't, why don't we let Alex roll first? Because I think Alex has been so hyped to go. Yeah, so. I thought Alex would probably sprint into the stack. So yeah, <laughs> Alex. Yeah, should. I'm trying to hold on to Alex. Really, <laughs> I mean. But... If you guys dally anymore, you're gonna need one of those like toddler harness things to like stop Alex. I, made one, I make one out of bubbles, like just like <laughs> Alex. <laughs> All right. Um. So okay. we're rolling. Change the game. Um, change the game. And uh, Alex would, I, I think, try to invoke maybe a keen keen observer and research uh -huh. master if going into a place labeled the stacks. Um. And also very surreptitiously pull out their little camera to record the excitement and enjoyment for posterity that's three. Oh, um, i don't think that's gonna work in there uh you know we you know this is that's i'm i i don't see why that would help you right in fact why uh, don't you just fine. leave that here to leave it behind no i'm just kidding i'll just put it away no, i'm just kidding i'm just kidding okay. it won't work anyway you know <gasps> oh, you're gone. Ooh, you're and you so didn't. Uh, ooh, ooh, yeah. And let's see. Oh, shit! I was uh, too late for. There was fatigued as well. Uh, so yeah. Oh, wow. No, well. Uh, ew, so, so God, the person who doesn't. Okay, so I got to figure out how to handle it because I want you to go in, but you can't go in with that role. What do you so, mean I can't go in? Uh, uh, <laughs> she ends up at one, or oh, so he ends at one, I, or they made different I'll, plays. Okay. I'll um, oh, deeper. I'll start inventorying the stacks. Here's for what you. I'll do. I here's what I'll do for you. I'll you, hypnotize him to get a reroll. <laughs> you can uh, uh, you can shit you can convert that into a success, but I will give you a lost six status that you can uh you can face danger against or or you can burn two tags for a success like for example research master or keen observer mm. and that will convert the failure into a success i want to see you succeed you know can, i like when the can, can i in here flash back research. to can i flash no, back not to in the middle of help point not in the middle of this. This is me. This is the hard move. Here. The hard move is is, is hard called uh, yeah. you know um, uh, it's it's not devil's bargain. That's 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 um, devil's advocate. No, no. Uh, no, that's devil's it's bargain. Is crime and villainy. This is the version of the of the. I've been reading crime and villainy. It's scrambling my brain. Uh, it's or um, uh, uh, it's force them to choose or something like that. Yeah. Hard um, choice? Ah. Uh, no, no, that's a different one. That's the one that you make yourself. This is force you to choose by, by saying, here's one hard move or here's another hard move. But I am being generous by conferring a uh, guaranteed success. So that's why I made the hard move like two times, you know, instead of just an ordinary hard move. Or what you, you could say, do? I don't want either of those yeah. and just take it a regular hard move, in which case you cannot go into the store. No, I think Alex, Alex. Alex needs to go in the store. Um, I will. Oh, you're going in with me, Maeve? Yeah, Teddy? I'm going in with you. All right, yeah, I'm going to burn the tags. And you're okay. going to have to pull me out of there. So, okay. so I have to burn both I mean, of them? You could, you could yeah, I think, the six. Uh, <laughs> I think, I think we all have to roll. You choose to burn a uh, research master, keen observer, or they equip and inspire me. Uh, Two out of th of those right. three, so and I, you will, I will burn. Yeah. They equip and inspire me and research master. 
Um, okay, so now you have one more thing to do. Store. This might be a little bit difficult. So you have to take a lost five status because it's a plus one, you know, to what you rolled. However, you can face danger. Yeah. Every one of you is going to do this part as well. All right, so I will oh, face, one of us I will doing face the danger. No, 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 no. Everyone also. that goes in must roll. Good. That's that's the rules. I don't make the rules, youngster. Young lady. Just, just making sure, thank you. All right, all right. You know, it says right here, I don't know if you saw on the sign, it says uh, no responsibility, or, or we we disclaim responsibility for, for uh, lost and... Uh, uh, lost and damaged people. It seems to be written in Quill. How how old is this store? Oh, it's pretty old. It, you know, although we got this sign from Costco, you can see it says items, and I scratched it out and I wrote people. <laughs> the items are pretty undamageable. A lot of them, you know. I mean, they look old. Like look at this scroll right here. It looks pretty old, but you know, it's got gumption. I don't even know why I use that word. I'm embarrassed that I said it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah. Alex is going to face danger um, to All try right. and mitigate some what, of that. What tags uh, would you like to face danger? Lost five is a pretty uh, heavy, heavy status. It is. Um, I think uh, Grin and Barrett. It's not so like, pull All it together. Right. You can do this. All right. Um, yep, yep. Tag. All right. Um, and... Uh, so the danger is getting lost, right, in the store. Yes. And so trying to well, it's trying I, to get your way out. You're going to be going, you know, you're going to feel lost yeah. just by being it's trying to get out. That's going to be the. Connection. Could I use my breath bends the air, kind of keep track of the the movement of air as we're going through? That to, uh, is track not my pattern. Lie. I don't know what you're thinking there. <laughs> all right then uh, yeah i got what i got here um keen observer that's all i keen no, observer keen observer, keen observer is gone burned yeah, gone. no i have keen observer and I'll it's use a link it, move then. anyway because this is a yeah. okay this is a, this is a face danger mediate with wisdom <laughs> what is it no okay mediate oh, with no wisdom. no no something with wisdom what yeah, so I have I have a mediate with wisdom. So like, I'll give you that one. All right, mediate all in the face bit. of danger. You know, it's not you know I, yeah, that might not fly in the same situation next time, but I feel like it's just good enough to make it this time. Can I kind of flash back and do a um, too late? <laughs> too late. Well, I'm already in the lost, help. Five, lost five status. But you do make you yeah okay. Uh, uh, we're gonna have everybody else roll, and then we'll all go together. Uh, this is not gonna be death, right? You know, it just it's just gonna be harder to get out. Uh, all right, who would like to go? You know, wow, your friend was very excited to go in. I I, I hope they uh, I hope they remember the way that they came through. But I don't know. Uh, anyway, who would like to roll next? Would it, would it be you, young lady? Yeah, I'll go. You might want to catch up. Your friend was very excited to get in. I mean, I, I can't blame them. I will go. Um, okay. I want Good to luck. use my eye for detail. Um, and uh, actually, you know, I'm kind of, uh, when as I'm walking in, I kind of turn around and I go, uh, not to change the plan, but maybe you shouldn't come in because I think I already lost Alex. Um <laughs> Why don't you just stay here? I'll, I'll go grab Alex. Okay, don't worry. Don't trust me. Maybe trust me. I okay. should go with. No, 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 Christine. Alex is gone. I trust you. I'm, not... I'm going into. I've I've waited okay. on the sidelines twice now. Okay, well, Chris, someone keep Christine here. Christine, um, look, I'm... it's a van over there. Oh, across the road at the park. Oh. Um, so I'm going to use my eye for detail. Uh. <clears throat> And my, uh, ooh, I don't have anything else to use, woot woot, um, to go in at least. All right, uh, well, you just have to succeed and change the game, don't forget. But remember, you're a little bit tired. Your your senses are I not know, as sharp. It would be a minus four. Are. 
Oof. Well, you just um, a minus one for fatigue, and uh, hey, you know that's all. It's it's you no know, big deal. Well, that would be a minus five, Polly. Well, uh, face, so. no, no, no. Um, sorry, I I corrected the oh, later. Okay. I guess I wasn't clear. You don't need to take a minus four to just to to oh, do. You just have to succeed okay. a basic like change the game rule. Right. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. So yeah, then I'll just do socially. Uh, sorry, an eye for detail. Okay. Um and. Can I uh, can I unburn the library crew theme and reuse it because this is technically kind of like a library, right? Like I, uh, I know library. You could library. do that. You could do okay. that. This unburning and burning though, it's really pissing me off. <laughs> I, you know, I know it's fair and all, but jeez. Well, I'm mechanically sour, but oh, it's getting yeah, reburned. Yeah, don't worry about frustrating it. Frustrating because I don't like uh, it. It's, it's okay. I roll really poorly. You know I'm going to roll really bad. Don't worry. I'm very um, excited at all the misses. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm already imagining what the hard move is going to be. You know what? I will I will burn the tag. I'll burn the library tag, and then I'll just invoke a weakness, so I'm back at a zero. <laughs> Would that make you happy? <laughs> you do what no, you okay. like. I, I don't mind that at all. That seems okay uh, to me. No, yeah. Well, seems how like the... you all are going to be in this store for a while. Yeah, at least I am. But well, you'll get uh, a lot of again. information. That's the you know. There's a bonus here. It may sound bad, but you might come out of there with the with everything that I have written in this book. Oh well, there oh, you nice. go. Oh, so, my thing's not scrolling. It's it's a miss, and I got excited. Uh, all it's right, not, yeah, well, there it hasn't you go. You succeeded. All, like, for me either. So you now have to roll a, a face danger against the uh, lost five status. Okay, I'm gonna burn a tag <laughs> for a hit. Is that cool? Can I do that for That's face danger? That's cool. You could do that, uh, um, that uh, but you will get a mixed success out of it. Oh no, no, because fatigue doesn't count this time. So you'll just get a, a full success and not wait. You won't take any status. That seems unfair, but it's that's how that works. Uh, Peter's I all over the place. Hold on, hold on. I gotta, I gotta find out what tag I can actually use to do that. So, to explain to me, how is the, this place laid out inside? Is it like you're um, gonna have to burn a relevant or... tag, though? You know, which, which one know. would you can like you to give burn? Me, let me try to burn the regular tag. I'm trying. Okay, to, okay so all right. <laughs> let me just, so let have, me just, um... let me just straighten my vest here. Well, these kids. Wow. Okay, so um, how, can you explain to me how uh, the layout is for this place? Like, is it is it like a library where like I'm walking through shelves, or is it like, is it? Um, are there like different uh, levels so to it? Is it like, open? When you to... <laughs> what you see right now is uh, what seems potentially a vast space behind you, but you can't make hide or hair of what's back there. It looks like to you, okay. it's just a bunch of shell. shell. I mean, it, it, you, it, it would like to a person who didn't realize that there's some, so something else going on here. It would look like just a, a, a confusing and messy store, but you can't okay. see really like where the stacks begin. It's it's uh there's there's you just don't know you just don't know mm -hmm. you know that it's gonna be it's gonna be hard to find your way out. Yeah, um, I mean the only thing that I have is a chat dice that I can use, um, and uh, <laughs> um, I mean you could burn a tag for it, like you said. I don't have any tags good. that would actually work. The eye for detail oh, is the only tag that I have that could be terrible, traversal. Unless I did like a like a I could uh use bubble magic to like get my way out, but then I wouldn't have my one tag that's my broad tag, so I don't want to get rid of that. Yeah, that's that. pretty terrible. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I might well, as well just use know. a chat die and go with it. I don't you know. Sometimes the mysteries are worth taking risks for, you know. Hopefully, I will get someday get the courage to go down that flow myself. You know what, though, I can use my care for others because I want to get out of here to be with I my friend. I don't want to be here. I, I believe be here you can. Forever. I believe okay. you can. Oh my god! Wait, I'll just burn my care for. Can I burn my care yeah. for others? Tag. Yeah, I think you can. I think okay. you can. This one. 
I'll burn, I'll burn care for others. I, I was reading through it and I was like, what cags can I use? Like, I have kill him with kindness, good judge of character, socially perceptive. Like, I am too social. Yeah, none of that really applies. But, but the care for others, because you're going in and you're, you're, you're like worried Alex. I mean, I mean, you're going in after Alex to like make sure that they don't get lost. So I think that applies. Uh, so yes, burn it and you take no status for some Thank reason. You, explain to me, explain explain to us how you don't get a lost status in a in a mysterious store with as a magical girl i use the power of friendship <laughs> no i mean like seriously though i think it's like you know i'm i'm holding like i'm pretty sure i'm going in holding penny's hand and i, I lose alex for a second i'm like oh my god like i need to grab i can't let alex get lost in here um and i will just you know like walk in with like i am focusing i'm not letting my mythos take over i'm not letting anything i'm just staying mavis thorn and i'm going to walk in this building i'm going to walk out with my friends and that child so i can go to fucking bed <laughs> yeah. well um, there you go uh, yeah. good good i like it so you 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 hurry in behind and you catch up with with uh uh with alex and who else is going to now, now that you see Mavis is able to catch up, you know that you're going to be able to find the two of them if you act now. Who's going in next? That would be more. Rolling right. change the game. Yes, we'll change the game. Um, so this is a minus one because of the fatigue, and I believe that's it, unless you want to activate a weakness. Um, no. I will think that <laughs> well, what's relevant is tracking, because I'm keeping track of where they're going. I feel like that's pretty Self-explanatory. Okay. Yeah. Um, I would say so. You seem well equipped for something like this, being an investigative reporter. Yeah, Having speaking of which step. investigative reporter with a power tech. I feel like that's yeah. pretty relevant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think that's okay. Even mind that you have that to get out work. too. You have to, oh, I know. You have to take the stats too. <laughs> I'll give Penny a help point. Um Cause, oh no! I'll wait. I'll wait until you change the game. Unless you're gonna burn a tag for change the game or to face danger. But I will. I'll go. Yeah. Okay. So then I'm, I'll use the help point now for you. Oh, thank you. So because you're holding my hands, you're literally guiding me yeah. further up. Yeah. I'm literally sense. making sure that you don't get lost. Cause I didn't get lost. So. Because <laughs> minus it's funny one. Funny how plus the mechanics three. made Alex uh, do exactly what what was appropriate. You know, the two of you are being more careful. So if it's. It's like the dice we're, we're reading our minds. Like they are, <laughs> the dice themselves are a relic from the store, if you think about it. Anyway. Everyone, everyone on top side is just like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Change the game. <laughs> Great. All right. We have a mild success. Hey, Thank God. Screw you guys. You're the one who retconned an entire character, and I don't I don't know if I'm gonna buy that either. I'm just kidding. You you kids have a good time. You succeeded. Oh, you got a mild success. Okay, that's that's good enough. So you are now facing a lost five status. Which I believe in. tracking would be the one to burn for that. So it made the most sense. Or yeah, just sure. used. If you want to burn it for a hit, for sure. For yeah, sure. I mean it's the one that makes the most sense. Uh, judging from you see, it has to be like to even though you watching. invoked it as a tag, I'm still gonna let you do it because I like when people burn tags. Okay, forgive me if I did that slightly wrong. Okay, I don't know. Uh, well, I, I think it might not exactly. I I, okay. I think that might be technically incorrect, but I'm gonna let it. I'm, I'm gonna let it happen because I I I prefer I, it. I have others. <laughs> <laughs> what that's, else? That's, that's like one that makes the most sense. Yeah, go with that uh, one. Because that one is a, you know, that one seems awfully useful. So why don't you just burn it? It does. One? It's also awfully relevant to being lost. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That's right. I'm well, going to okay. apply a hurt point to No, could you imagine? Like, <laughs> <laughs> I want to get you in, but I don't want to get you out. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Excuse me. <laughs> Cross through the threshold. Take no status. You are able to maintain your sense of sense of where you are, but you know that it is due to the the every bit of fiber of your legendary being that you're able to be convinced that you can make your way out. However, your friend Alex is well already on their way to trying to discover the secrets that are in, in the store. There are magnificent items. There are old items, shiny items, 
paper items, metal items, shelves of books with uh, uh, languages that you know or you don't know. Some look like Latin, some look like pure symbols, some dusty, some new, some have plastic on them. So, some of them look like they have not been touched in decades. You wind your way through where the lights become a little bit dimmer. Some, some, uh, some of the lighting is out at some point. There's branching, uh, there's one, one aisle branches into another. You, you don't know, there's no signs about, you know, uh, different sections. You, you, fee, you see, you begin to feel, uh, well, you feel this almost immediately, but it grows as you uh, feel yourself getting heavier and heavier. You get a slight psychedelic effect. Uh, things sort of seem wavy beyond just their their uh, their physical being. It's almost as if the gravity in the whole place is kind of off. You feel heavy as you sort of go a little bit down. You walk down, down because you're you're trying to get to the good stuff at the bottom. Uh, when you immediately enter, you know the floor the floor and the ceiling are kind of darker, blacker. Uh, as you descend into the store, it becomes more uh, white, bright. You descend further, further into the store. And hold on a second. I don't know why I'm scrolling right now. I'm just, I'm, you know, this is not something that matters. I'm just making the colors <laughs> up as I go along. Get some real back rooms feel from this. I'm not yeah, sure I like so, it. <laughs> uh, you make your way. Yeah. Uh, so it's black and then it gives way to white. Uh, it, it gives way to red. Would, let me tell you this: before you, you're going to go to the deepest, the deepest part of the store, which means you're going to pass by the the level one, call it level two, level three, level four. That's not exactly right because it's kind of a maze. But you know, let's say you're on level one, waking your way, looking around at the magnificent mysteries. Look, there's a ship in a bottle, and the ship. And the water is kind of like flowing underneath it. Like, well, that's kind of interesting. You look around and there's a there's like a bell, but the but you could pick it up and ring it and it doesn't make any noise until you put it down and then you hear the noise. Uh, you see a map that that looks like you know uh, a map of the city now, but you look away, you look back, and then it looks like a map of the city as it was a long time ago. And then you look away and you look back and the map shows you something that is incomprehensible it's so strange you look away is there anything you want to do on level one? Oh, we can do stuff at each level is that what you're allowing us to do i'm allowing you to do it ah, okay uh oh, so do we like do you yeah. Anybody who wants you, to do an investigation or whatever you want, you know. Yes, Alex, you seem like you might be one for. Uh, can I go into level one? Be here for the game. You... Sure, Gosh. you can. You can, but you must roll. Yep. Change the game, and and let me tell you this: if you choose to go to level one, that's all you will be able to make it to. You will lose your group. Mm -hmm. Okay, roll. Change the game then. Uh. Um, um, hold up. As Chucks begin to walk close, right? And I was like, uh, Chuck, you what? where are you going? Uh, that way. And in case of emergency, I didn't want to tell them this, but, um, but Christine, um, take this if you want to go as far as you want and give her the, like, the blue... Is this a good um, idea for you to be doing? Sure. I'll be right. Uh, it's, I, it's, I'll be right. I can, I can hear them just down there. Uh, this does not seem safe. And I'm like, maybe sort of a little bit kind of worried about you or whatever. Don't tell anyone. Or I'll make sure no one even remember you. Okay. But I am a little worried about you. It's okay. Can you just, enter? Just, 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 just a little bit. Just, just, why don't we do, instead of doing that, you know, messing up with their whole thing, which seems very important, why don't we just go to the park and fucking uh, throw a ball around, huh, bud? How about that? You like football? 
<laughs> don't you? Come on. Yeah, we cheer for them. You should know what sport they play at this point. It's, it's, it's they all um, look the same. It's, it's like, yeah, actually, it's honestly kind of does. So they're they're like, all pretty know. similar. They all have a ball uh, going so into a thing. It's so good that we can't quit cheer together. It's honestly. like, half of the time I was like, we're doing a great job at this, but also, what are we cheering for? I legit broke my back at some point doing one of those stupid cheers. Uh, Christine's making a joke because we've never, we don't remember football games. Like, we, we have a football team and a cheer squad, but we don't know when we've had a football <laughs> game before. Ever. Ever. <laughs> so what do you say, bud? Why don't we go and throw a ball into a thing, huh? And you can call it whatever you want. You can call it tennis or all I care. I don't really give a fuck, to be honest. Or... Or if we combine our power together, if they mm -hmm. took too long, we can try and open. Oh, he's already together. going in. You guys. Oh, fuck yeah, me. Know, uh, her Does anyone have her points on him? Hurt him. <laughs> yeah, if I got help post, <laughs> you can't hurt me post. Well, you didn't You didn't even say right. you were rolling. You just kind of put I, No, I said in. what I was oh, doing. Give us a chance. Yeah, that's right. You, you didn't, didn't even tell me your tag. So, uh, well, I guess you didn't. You didn't give me uh, a sorry, chance. I have X-ray vision and I can reveal enchantments. And I put the minus two of fatigue. All right, you succeeded. I, I didn't go. I didn't push but, too know, far on any on anything there. I just wanted to take... listen to what them and then just walk away as they were trying to. Oh okay. Oh okay. All right. So, but you take loss too, which we have to have to uh, face danger for. Yeah. Anyway, I think that with all of us three power, Fuck he's me, gone, isn't he? Yes, he is. Um, burning. Oh, um, burning. I can't go in after him. I don't. Burning I an can't. engineering student. <sighs> okay. And 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 then you're gonna burn a tag, succeed, and then leave. Mm -hmm. Is that what you said? That, okay. Well, burning um, the, burning my my logistics of being an engineering student. I know. Yeah, yeah. I, I, that's all engineering. Like it's like the structure yeah, there. Is, that's um, there. That so that's a level bin. So I know we've got to go past that. It's about the middle. I, I kind of know my way around a place, even if it's all. Yeah. Sold me on it. Makes yeah. sense. So I'm not as lost as possibly. Well, at least oh, some so of them. Before you leave, Chuck, you look around, you see a book that says tinctures. You kind of understand there's transmutation books. You want to take a look at any of these books? Is there anything that, that catches your interest? I, I was excited by the map. But... Okay, you can take a look at that too. Mm. Do you want me to do an investigation? Well, what would you like to accomplish by, by, by taking the map? I that want to investigate the map and see like what it like what it can like what it can show like and if it'll help oh, i see well when you when you go to the map you know how the store owner said the the items choose you mm -hmm. when you approach the map to take a look at it it turns into a mirror and then you see yourself and then it turns it turns you into a, a, a you know you see the worst qualities of yourself and you turn away the map does not want to go. I don't like that one. No, it, no. I start exploring. Nothing personal. Then. The map says. I start exploring to anything else. I'm more appropriate which... for another buyer. I'll start exploring anything else that will that will allow that will pick me. Okay. Okay. Well, I think what you what would be helpful if you want to roll investigate and do reverse clues that might help. Mm hmm. Can I still? Is this a linked? Part from the last one? No, no, no. This will be, you know, we'll wipe this lay clean to see if there's any Chuck related items. Like maybe there's a football in there that will confer uh, unlimited knowledge. You'll you'll never forget the playbook. Um, I don't really have anything here anyway. So, um, let's go. Let's explore. Um, so I'm using. Um, my x-ray vision and um, reveal enchantment so I can see through the stacks to find the next thing. So I can okay. broaden my all search. Right. That's all. All right. I like it. I like it. And investigate. Uh, but yes. you're still fatigued, though. Don't forget. Oh, yes. Still fatigued. Yeah. Go so minus yeah, that again. Gonna be every tough. Every time. Yeah, pretty much every time, unless it's a linked move. Um, And... Yeah, I've got nothing else I can do. Okay, plus one. That's it. Let's investigate. Well, there you go. You got a success. However, I got a. I, 
It is a mixed success, so feel free to. Uh, that's, let, a, you, the, no, that's a twelve. Uh, oh, yeah. you didn't oh, scroll. Sorry about it. Twenty isn't not, scrolling. My thing isn't scrolling. Oh, yours isn't scrolling either. Yeah, no, it my no, scroll. It's not been scrolling all night. Oh, okay, all right. Well then, congratulations, great success. You can do a reverse clue, or you can ask me a question. This might be more uh, colorful if you do a reverse clue. Well, so I can give myself something. Mm. Well, I don't know. I don't know. That's what it sounds like. <laughs> Football cleats. I mean, I mean, I mean. If you wanted to give yourself something, you could give yourself a. I should have said change the game. If you wanted to give yourself something, so uh, so uh, you could use that to change the game as well, if you'd like. Since I, you know, you actually clearly said what you wanted. Uh, well, I was do, looking so, for something that would. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Now, now, sadly, sadly, yeah. the thing that you choose. You could probably take it with you, but it's only going to give you a power for one next roll. It's only yeah, going to be useful. That's the thing. Be yeah. yeah. So, so, so no matter what I do. You can choose investigate. You can choose. Uh, so investigate. You know. Okay. It's probably going to have the same effect either way. So do a reverse clue on it. <laughs> um, so I'm look, looking for something that can help us find the kid. Oh, so, so, the kid. Mm, nah, yeah, the, the kid's the important too, thing. You're too, you're too, you're, you're, you're Even not. Even the slightest. Deep, no. you're, the, you, you just enter. There's just fun, there's fun little trinkets here. Nothing's going to be able to decipher, uh, you know, the location of any specific person. You, you know, you happen to wander in. A couple of things might, might tickle your fancy, you know. Um, well, I'm, let's I'm, have a look. Okay, at I'll put it this way. Uh, Ladybug, Cat yeah. Noir. Anything that will help us find the kid or rescue the kid. So Ladybug, Cat Noir, like any random thing that can help us do that. No, you're not deep enough in the, like in the not, store. Not like oh, fully God. find them, but anything that will give us a plus one at the time when we're trying to do it. Oh, you want to change the game? Oh, well, yeah, okay. well but, it's still but, the but, similar but, thing. You can't do that because you would have to have rolled a 10. Well, or, and then there's have a, a 12. Two, so. The only thing I can tell you, okay, 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 we had a power of, okay, oh, oh, you're right, you're right, never mind, because that gives you a minimum of two, so you could say, okay, so tell me what it is, tell me what no, you find. No, you know, you know, the, you know where, what it is, so you can tell us this random thing, which when we find them, might actually come into play, but I don't know what it does right now, or how it'll be coming to play now. Uh, all right. That's, that's what I'm thinking. Um, or is that too much for okay, the GMC? Well, well, what catches your fancy is a little bit of a dra uh, it's a toy it's a child's toy, right? And and it's a little dragon toy. And if you push the button on it, it lights up and uh, and and uh, a a tiny a tiny little uh, uh, flashlight shoots out like it's supposed to be like a, a flaming dragon, but it's just a light. You know, it's just for kids. Uh, and it, whenever you push it, it shines a light toward. A child who has recently been close to a uh, a legendary manifestation of dragons that have been fl fire breathing dragons. That's a bit and, specific. And to the best of your knowledge, there's only cool. one of those around. That's very specific. Yeah. Kind of weird. You just found that right there, but mm -hmm. whatever. That'll give you a plus one. Mm -hmm. It's a nice little. It, it, it's a finely crafted item. Yeah. It's, I just think I've. I might be able to swap it for the for the for the yeah, toy you know, find it all. You know, you know this dragon. You know, like the guy at the counter did say though that there's a price to all mm. these things. And so, you know, I wonder, <clears throat> I wonder how badly you would like this. You know, you get to this is yours to keep, right? But if you take it out of the store, you might not. Eh, it might come at a cost later on. So. If you would like to get out of there without a cost in the future, you could, uh, before you get war warped in there, you know, like it's it's very intriguing. Uh, and if you don't leave now, you'll have to take lost one. Just lost one, that's all. And in fact, you have fatigued one, which means it's almost like you don't take a status at all. Except for that you have to clear it to get out. Or, or you can leave uh, with no status and, you know, maybe the price will be free. Uh, 
how about I take it and take the lost one? Uh huh. Okay. Um, and fight the lost one by burning my um, understanding of my logical understanding of physics and in trying to get out of here. You could do that, uh, uh, but you could just roll face danger too. You'd only have to get a mixed success to avoid the status entirely. You wouldn't have to burn a tag, but 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 I mean, feel free to burn a tag if you'd like. Yeah, because it's a one, so you just need a. It, it, when you get a mixed success on face danger, it's a minus one. Yeah. So you, so you don't only need a seven, 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 seven or higher. Okay. I just wanted to give you a mild status. That's all. To yeah. Let's just face danger. And, okay. Um, with my coach's playbook and my understanding oh, of physics. Oh, I like it. I like it. All right. Okay. And Coach minus one playbook. to the fatigue. Okay. There we go. So there you go. No status at all. I don't even know, you know, I don't even know why I bothered to describe the mystery. You're, you know, you are on a mission. Not lost for even a second. We have a new Chuck. Smarter, more educated, better judgment. And with glasses. Yeah. And you have a fine dragon item that uh, you know, you're gonna be able to pay no price for. It's free. It even says free for Chuck only. How did you know my name? Either way, I'm happy. Hi guys. Chuck, what are you doing? I said specifically to stay. Oh no, I found this. I'm going out. Bye. There's so many interesting no, guys. No, no, no. I found this. Like little dragon toy. It's got a flashlight. See? It's okay. I'll, 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 see, like, I'll see you there, soon. There are literal spears of ancient monsters. Oh, oh and I, I gave Sorry. I gave Christine the blue pill. She won't come near us if she, if she eats it. Good job. Very smart. Uh... So people oh, outside the stacks, what are you doing? And I head back out the stacks. Wait, so okay. is, Chuck, is Chuck, Chuck back? Chuck, Chuck, Chuck re-emerges and what What would you like to do? Uh, and I'd, like to, back to yeah. I'd like to think that the whole time I was just talking with Christine about how mm -hmm. we explain this to the others and like... The conversation is still yeah. going about Chuck going. Do we make yeah. do we make a funeral arrangement? What is like, what do and, we do? And Christine's just like... He's not coming uh, back. Honestly... How about we just focus for one second? Because, like, I think with our combined effort, we can, like, totally save them. But I just need to mm -hmm. know, like, uh, you know Maeve longer than I do. Mm -hmm. And, like, with the, everything that happened at the frat house, it seems like you didn't trust her or the plan. And I just, I'm just not sure what that's about. Because we met in college, and like even before mm. then, you, I think you knew her longer than I did. So like, what's up with that? Oh, you remember that? That's crazy. Well, it's slowly coming back to me. Mm -hmm. Also, it was really bold of you to go to one of the most popular sorority recruit and just like ask to join. I had to. I mean, why not? Um, I was like, you're you. so not our style. <laughs> But you're like so going to feel the diversity quota is perfect. Absolutely, that's my <laughs> that's my job. Are man. you outside the store right now? Are you in the alley? Yeah, yeah, we're in the oh, alley. No, we're in an alley. In the, I thought they were in the store, just like talking, but not in the stacks. Yeah, but not, in, but the not in the stack. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you're still in the store. All right. You see a car drive by. It splashes water from the gutter onto the. Well, sorry, you're in the alley. You hear a car mm -hmm. drive by in the distance. Right. Yeah, but I just wanted to know what that's about because I was like, I trust Dave, and mm -hmm. you know her longer. So, like, what happened? Here's the thing, right? Mm -hmm. There is people are different people too. You know, like they they change throughout the times and. And when you grow, you you tend to make your own personality, make your own life, right? The thing with Maeve is that when when her powers started like coming up and started bubbling to the surface, there were parts of her that I did not recognize. Ah, bubbling! I just got it. Get it? Yeah. <laughs> 
Um, it's because of Papa. Yeah. <laughs> I had to. I mean, it was right there. And yeah. the part that I didn't recognize was a part that I don't know if I would trust with my life. Hmm. Does that make sense? I mean, like, it's still sense. her, right? But it's not. Well, yeah, but when I met her, she's always that person, you know, like that knows right. what to do with her power and everything. So I guess we just saw a different side of her. I'm so sorry I didn't meet her earlier when you're like, she's cool. And I'm like, she's a poetry major. How cool can she be? Um, but yeah, also, you were sure the she was fishing poles on sale. Available in, uh, you know, in white. And white? Why would you want a white fishing pole? You'd want um, to go with like because a, like it's a like go with the outfit, duh. Uh, that's true. You'd get a pink one. Yeah, but wait, if you wear a cute outfit, why would you go fishing? That sounds true. like something that poor, oh, boring people do. Guys, it's a soft and we world. are none of those things. <laughs> 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 I know their hands. Guys, They're all soft What's up with the yeah. fishing rod? Sorry, where is it? What's happening? It's just, it's just a... Where is it? <laughs> Do I look so the fact it's it? white and we just saw white flash in front of our eyes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but what's what's up with the fish? It just we don't know what's up with the fishing rod. It's that you guys are talking for long enough that Polly is starting to use soft moves to move the scene along. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, all I'm just trying to say is that you're like one of the bravest person I know. Definitely braver than Chuck. Can say that now that he's not here to contest that. So Thanks, so man. And maybe the old like man of, behind the counter sees you talking and says, "What's up, dude? You think you, you, you think you're, um, uh, you know, your friends are very brave. Uh, are, are you sure that I can't uh, sell you anything? You know, I mean, look right here. You don't even have to go inside the stacks Ooh. to see these wondrous items, right? Actually, that's not like? bad. What what's what what would you what would you recommend to be honest yeah i love that mirror that you have that hand mirror i can use a new one. Oh uh, well you know what you, you have a fishing you, aisle okay so uh here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna cut down to the to the uh to the to the stacks where 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 the the <laughs> Where the shelving is narrowed in stacks form, and you have to go single file through. What would you, before you venture into say, the black becomes the white? I don't know. If, you know, it's not exactly paint. In fact, at the psychedelic effect in the wave, it sort of fades from black to white. However, you still see color, but it's also overlaid by a, you know, a sort of a color color fading effect as you go from. I don't know, you feel like one floor to another. Would you like to uh, do anything before you move further deeper into the stacks? You pass oh. through a th you pass through a threshold, things become brighter. Uh, you look around and you see the same, you see even more, uh, you thought <laughs> that the, you, you thought that the floor that you saw was packed. There's even more things. It's almost like, uh, uh, you know, the ceiling has gotten higher. Uh, you, you, it's a little bit tighter where you are, but you almost, and you look up and you can't even see the ceiling all of a sudden. It's just, it's too dark up there, but it's so bright where you are. Maybe your eyes are not adjusting and you make your way through. You see books, you see uh, uh, various artifacts. You see like, you know, um, interestingly, you see uh, uh, things that look like relics from ancient Egypt. Can Alex pull any of the books off yeah. the shelf? Sure, 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 sure. I'm waiting for someone to jump in there. Go ahead. What would you? Uh, are you just pulling any random book? You could tell me. Yeah, no, no. They sort of, they're sort of scanning down. They run their their finger along, um, and they find one that has um, kind of cracks along the edge of the spine, and yet somehow the rest of the leather looks kind of new. Um, and the okay. color is really indistinct. Um, and they, pull, you know. I used to hear about a book like this. And so, like Alex pulls it off the shelf and uh, tries to open it. All right. Can I so it? would you like to roll investigate or change the game? Or I think it's investigate if you're looking Ooh. for answers. I would love to roll investigate. That okay. sounds great. This seems like the, have... uh, the moment for a reverse clue as well, if you would like. 
Um, yeah, I have almost no tax. Does my lost five apply here? No, 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 no. No, you're, the, you know, not at all. That's only if you want to leave. This <laughs> only, it's only when I try to leave. So I'll just use my keen observer and roll. Okay. Investigate. Well, there you go. Uh, give us a, uh, oops, yeah. sorry, it doesn't scroll. Okay, cool. Still say, it's the same as, a, you, you have a great success. Excellent. Well, as a question, make a reverse clue, whatever you like. Um. So Alex picked this book because they, you know, they remember some of the, what they at the time thought crazy things that Sanders used to talk about. Um, yeah. And one of them was um, a book uh, that would manifest maps of anywhere you wanted to travel. Um, and, and this book kind of looks like that because it's sort of, uh, it has the same kind of leather and stuff. So, so they're not quite sure, but they're hoping maybe that if they open it, um, there'll be a map of the city that might show them where the child is. I'm still looking oh, for the child. Okay. All right. Hmm. Maybe. They don't know if okay. they're not quite sure if it's that book or not. We're on level two. That, we're on level you three. know the book? Mm -hmm. So tell me tell me how the book tells you where okay, so 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 uh the child is being currently under uh under underground in a in a subway station uh being held in a in a in an old subway station uh not inoperable it is it is uh underneath the um uh, the old quarter in fact it may be near some place that you've taken public transportation we'll say it is it is uh uh somewhere near the um What's the name of the old station? I like when I put this on the players. Um, yeah, it, it, it it's it's decommissioned or it's currently in use. Uh, it's decommissioned. decommissioned. Central. Uh, it's. Oh, we said. Go... Pendragon. What are you gonna say? Pendragon. 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 Okay. All right. All right. Uh, <laughs> Pendragon <laughs> station. Okay, can I Since add to that? The new closed, Pendragon station. Near... Which is well, now decommissioned. Well, the new pen, well, right, the new Pendragon station is the one that's below the university that you've been to many times. The old Pendragon station is where the child is being held. I, I, like I a, figured... a big scrolly map kind of draws itself on the page and we see it. We see it circled there. I like that name too. I think Kosh may have plans for that name. <laughs> <laughs> that reaction. I just like the idea of a, a decommissioned location being the new, but it's oh, like, as in, it was originally oh. the new one and the new always oh, stuck, but it's so old that it's like, it just kept the new. And even so though it's now the new, derelict new and gone. The new uh, yeah. I like old versus new. Cause yeah. you know, I will do that. This, maybe but it is crap. Book and she says, wait, the show is like a map of helpful. anything. You found oh, her. You have to gen. Didn't really want to go I mean, there. you look at it again, and and it show doesn't show anything. Anymore. Okay, okay, okay. She like shuts mm -hmm. the book, and then she goes like, "A place where my parents love me," and then just opens the <laughs> it. Was... Empty page. That's wow. what I thought. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, where <laughs> was the kid? Yeah. It says wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. No, I wanna. I wanna what? investigate. Wait. I want. I have a question. No, where wait, was no. the kid? <laughs> first things first. Old Pit no, Dragon no, Station. Thank you. But now, how much do I care about my sister being missing? Nah, I don't care. Never mind. I could I ask that question, either. but I don't really care. I thought that's where you were going. I know. Okay. I was thinking more like, where where will my parents finally love me? Just like nothing. Yeah. All right. Well, it has, I, it has to be sense. a real place, Nave. Real I know, place. and that's very unrealistic. <laughs> it's a you great. happen to see there, some there. newspaper clippings out of the corner of your eye weirdly uh about the um about the death the uh uh 
death via seemingly foul, foul play from a Dr. Sanders. But then you look back and it's gone. Hmm. I think um, if Alex saw those, like, attached to the book, they'd shut the book real fast and, like, okay, shove yeah, it back well, on the yeah, shelf. Yeah. yeah. I think I say we go deeper. I'm pretty sure she's probably on the fourth floor or something. Like, well, I mean, if we know where she is. You're, you're right? nowhere near Pendragon, Pendragon Station. Old or that's, new. Yeah. That's amazing. So we have further questions we can ask about Old Pendragon Station. Maybe, like, Maybe there's like a police report somewhere around here or something else like that. I'd like to roll investigate to see if there's any weird activity in the underground station. Sure. Maybe sure, there's sure. like a you document or something. Sure, you could do that. These are all, uh, you know, medium depth clues. There's more deeper, of course. Yeah, I think like You've obscure clues around yeah. there maybe is pretty... Sure, pretty I'm sure. Well, I mean, mild. there's a lot of things. Possible. As you look around, there's the magnificent items. Here. Could be definitely deeper. Or um, you might bottom. Like I already know what I'm gonna ask when I get down there. <laughs> you see a little well, cush or, or, or a little scrunchy ball, like a little stress ball, and it says helix on it. <laughs> yeah. There's a, there's a, literally a million questions I could ask you. But I don't want to be here for an hour rolling investigate. <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> so I'm just gonna roll this one first. Um, power of one, which is uh, snooping around. Okay. Feel free to, to uh, wait. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's perfect. Go for it. I won't. I, I won't invoke a weakness tag because that's a dick move. You're are you are fatigued. I don't forget. Yes. It's, it's equal to one. It's equal to zero. So it's okay. Oh, okay. Okay. All right then. I'll get ready to scroll so I don't I don't misinterpret <laughs> these results. We have a miss. Oh, I'm so sorry. the The whole building starts on fire. <gasps> no, no, no. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Right, okay. <laughs> well, it's okay because uh, me and Penny can leave. <laughs> one of us can't. Uh, why don't you? <laughs> Why don't you burn your tag? Uh, what was the one you used for this roll? Snooping yeah. around. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Um, Wait, did you? It see. doesn't look like you even used it. Uh, I equaled out to zero because I had a weakness anyway, so I just didn't yeah. burn it. But it still you know what? I don't think you need to. Tags. I don't. I don't think you need to. I can't really burn that one anyway, because uh, uh, because I don't even know why. I can't even imagine how that would how, how that would burn in this situation. <laughs> so like. Um, I, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, why don't you take uh, lost? I get two. a jump scared or something. Yeah, I'll take lost two. Lost two. You can face danger if you like. I would. I would love to. Yeah, because that's uh, that's the trouble. Uh, so face danger, lost two. Um, Try as you might I... to find looking for you. You you uh you know you lose track of your. Uh, you, you can't remember as well, but your way out. Yeah, that's uh, that's that. Uh, could I use the same ones I used for the first lost roll, or is this like a, uh, yeah. its own yeah. thing? Okay. Yeah, it's not linked. This is a different time. This is a different thing that you've done to get yourself lost. Okay. That's uh, slip past security. I burned tracking, so that doesn't seem relevant. Well, um, past security doesn't doesn't seem relevant. Oh no, sorry, okay. no. That, investigate the reporter. Okay. Apologies. Okay. All right. And then. I'd like to give myself some uncanny encouragement, which is a new power attack I got. Okay. Explain to me what that means. I to mean, encourage I mean, myself in an uncanny yeah. way. <laughs> I mean, we're in an uncanny area, so you know what? You don't even have to say that much. You could just do it. I want to make myself up. I can do this. I believe in myself. The power of self-belief. With through all these oh. uncanny items. <laughs> and I, I believe in a miracle because we just got a we just got a hey, thing. Right. Thank you, Magic Man, for gift subbing um, to um, Epic Fables. Epic Fables is a um, oh, one of the places that we raid often. Um, so thank you so much. That's a gift, and that goes to Epic uh, Fables. Is Paul Karsh? It is. It is. Oh, fuck! It is too. I always. Think of you I'm just saying. Give some to to Paul. To Paul. Yeah. Thank you yeah. for the, end up the generous Paul. donation, my friend. Yeah. <laughs> I keep on forgetting the episodes. Yeah. Anyway. Anyway. Um. And that means everyone gets two track dice. 
Which yeah, I will absolutely use, stuff, huh? you wow. You can use one at a time, though. But yes, you'll I use I will use one. <laughs> All right. Feel gonna... free. If you would like to use both, I'm going to let you do it this time. Uh, just use the wall and thank you All right. very much. Okay. All right. I mean, I, hey, hey, I'm just trying to help. Change the game, right? Uh, roll, uh, roll face danger. Face danger. Thank you. Mild success. All right. Then Over you nine. take lost one. That's lost one. Okay. Thank you. All right. So, uh, can yes. I, can I try to like change the game to like maybe because I can see Alex is kind of like getting way too into staying here so I kind of want to to like maybe be like hey Alex you have a lot more to live for and I have a poem for it so like I would love sure. to try to change the game to convince Alex feel free that's somebody's got to do it sometime <laughs> they're lost okay, and I want to do it right before now. before you fail an investigation <laughs> and take a bigger loss and then we lose you forever um so I'd like to tone it down um I'm mm -hmm. gonna take a uh, woman of words um and I'm going to use uh, my kill him with kindness tag. Um, I will use uh, socially perceptive because I'm picking up on some things about Alex that would make them want to stay in up top side instead of the things that would make them okay. want to stay down here. So like those, you know. Okay. Um, uh, I could use good judge of character and then I could use my weakness that is sugar-coated words which basically means that alex could probably if they if i fail could tell that i'm bullshitting them <laughs> like kind of it like it's, it is a little bit of bullshit okay um, you know like i i let me ask work? you this alex are you inclined to listen to this person screw up your like your vibe here uh, you know i i trust mave um right. and i know that she is deeply familiar with getting overly carried away. So I'll give her a listen. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. <laughs> Maybe I might leave your ass down here if you keep talking like that. Don't you better cut I just want to find out if we're going to have a go toe to toe thing here or if it's just going to no, be. You know. <laughs> so is it changed the game? Uh, I'm going to let you do that. I, you know, the less powerful option would be convince instead. Uh, but go ahead I mean, it doesn't matter. Either way, I'm fine with that because I still get plus one juice if I when I roll. So, um, so uh, gonna... yeah, but like I... one, hey, hey, can you reduce a status with with convince? You can only no, give but a status. you can apply a status. So that's why I'm trying to reduce the status yeah. of lost yes. with by convincing Alex that they don't want to stay lost and to actually show them that they should they should want to leave. Because I think okay. the problem with Alex is that that they're not like they're not. Um, I think convince is going to be the way to go. About being lost. Convince makes more of a mechanical uh, sense here because Alex can say, "I don't care. I'll take the status." Right? Or, you know, I'm not going to do what you say. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I, I thought it would be more fun if Alex fought me. That's why I said change the game because <laughs> I was like, I'm pretty sure they'll fight me on this. But okay, I'll do convince. Um, that would be go toe to toe in that case, but. Okay. Convince. Kachow. Okay, what do we got here? We have oh, okay. It's a All four, right, so. so it's a it's tier four status that they can take her. Okay, I have, so I have a move that um, it's this is my moment. It's an improvement for my personality, and it's once per session you can close plus one tier when you convince, or plus one uh, juice when you change the game using tags from this theme. Okay, so, so what status would you like to uh, uh, give to Alex, and then they can decide whether or not to take the status or give in a little, but protect their own agenda. Um, I think the status would be, um, there's no place like home for, um, <laughs> okay. for no other reason. Um, and I would like Maeve to just be like, Alex, let's take a moment. Okay, before we go any deeper, you know, I know that like this is a lot, and it's a lot to take in. Um, but you know, and, and knowledge is great and all. I love knowledge. I, I'm totally down for power hungry knowledge. Love it. You know, I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Um, hear me out though. Uh, I think you know <laughs> you may feel like you have nothing going on for you above ground. You know, you're the whole college thing and not graduating and everything else is going on. But keep in mind that you know you do have friends 
I am your friend. Okay, I am your friend, friend? no matter what you say. And on top of that, I think I know a poem. Uh, it's really funny. It's actually by Alexander Pope. Um, and do you know that one, the, A Little Learning? Um, basically, like the beginning part is like, a little learning is a dangerous thing. Deep drink or taste, not the, uh, how do you pronounce that word? It's it's an English word. Um, this is Viv, not um, not the spring, the, sh the their shallows, drought, intoxicate the brain and drink largely uh, and drinking largely sobers us up again it's a, it's pretty complicated um i don't know if you got that but basically knowledge bad uh knowledge can be bad for you sometimes especially if there's too much of it i know that that is not something that you agree with and i don't agree with it most of the time either but i think you know if anything if you stay down here where how are you going to show all of your research and everything that you've done to the rest of the world how will you ever be acknowledged for anything that you've done you know, you'll just be written off. And that's exactly what you're already afraid of is being written off by your professor. So if you stay down here, you're gonna just fade away like, you know, Kel, but like in a more literal sense. And I don't think you want that. Let's, let's, let's be real honest here, Maeve. Like, I, I don't exactly have a lot of credits to begin with. And I mean, look at the things that are down here. And maybe the knowledge is a little dangerous. I, I do recognize that a little knowledge has gotten me in a lot of trouble lately. But I mean, I mean maybe, maybe you're maybe you're half right. But we have to find the kid, right? We're, we're only halfway through the store. This is, really, this, this is the bridge which we could we could cross later. Yes? Yes, yes, it maybe. Is, maybe. But I don't want to but I don't want to lose you before that. So like, I'm trying to preemptively before we go any deeper, because I'm already feeling myself kind of getting lost with the stuff that we're finding, because there's so much stuff that I could, I could stay here for so hours. Many. Yes, yes, yes. Same yes. here. But, but we have friends up there that want us back and we have lives to get back to. And frankly, I, I need you there to be a roommate that buys fresh milk. So like, what, what are you going to do? Leave me high and dry like that? <laughs> be your roommate? You are my roommate. What are you talking about? You literally called it our apartment today. You live in <laughs> one of my spare rooms. Well, yes, but you never admit it. You stole my keys. <laughs> of course you're my roommate now. Like, I don't know what you want from me. So mechanically, if, I, if I'm if i half giving in, is that like a... Is it, is it a uh, four well, or nothing? Is that what we're... Yeah, so, so, so I think what would make the most sense is, like, you can take the status and you can use that status to help you get out of the of the um uh of the store uh but or you it's can still be ready to leave yeah yeah it's going to be up to you to use it you know like the way you sort of like uh the way you acknowledge this is like you can you know you know now you know that you could follow your friend out i think um however you could still choose not to right uh, or it's, it's but more if you do drive. choose sorry what's that I yeah it's more, more of a, a so I, I, like i to, take this to leave well yeah to get so, like out, i will take you know, yeah. yeah, yeah. I will take the status, but like I have to choose to use it when we're ready to. Yeah, right. If you want to leave, oh, wow. yeah. So you'll have yep. four tier four, no place like home. <laughs> Do I have to click my heels together to use it. Uh, that's copyrighted. You can't say. That. You can't. <laughs> that's the copyright part, actually. I can really if they're funny silver part. shoes, right? Uh -huh. you, you can if they're silver shoes. Um. <laughs> but apparently that the red ones are copyrighted. That's okay. You see no, shoes that what are red white. Shoes. No red shoes. There's white shoes that you could take. Oh, I don't want to take those. They're, they're made of glass. <laughs> and... Color mm -hmm. changes shoes. Trans alert. Trans alert. Do we know? Um, there's, there's one made of glass. The just there. <laughs> well, I'm assuming, you know, this place might go, if it goes deeper, I'm assuming it might go right into the subway. Like, if we go deeper, I saw the rattle falling into Valerian's, so it must mean We also she's know deeper. that there's a tablet that we're looking for, and, and, and just because we find the child doesn't mean we'll be able to take them back with our, you know, present level of not all magical girlness. I, I think this is a great idea. We should have a very quick siesta and just you know, nail down what we absolutely want to find out. We know where the girl is. That's freaking awesome. I love that to bits. But there's also what happened at the um, the alchemy shop at Chinatown, which was really weird as hell. There's the the rattle, which we haven't found yet. Oh, the and then the girl. The, ra the girl has the rattle. Holidays. 
or we don't know. Holiday that, says though. they're looking well, for a I, tablet. A tablet. I'm pretty sure. Like I am a hundred, almost yeah. ninety eight percent sure that she has the rattle because I don't think anyone wanted to take it away from her. I think that's why she's here is because she's the only one that can hold it, or at least well, can then... maintain its power. Not rattle would be a good one to find then. Yes. If, if the girl isn't what here, maybe the brought... rattle. What if they brought her here because something here could contain the rattle? I mean, this place is pretty magical. It's probably some kind of like magical other world. It doesn't feel like we're actually in reality right now, does it? So, There's yeah. also Cult of the God King, which we know is a thing. I, I'm going to be uh, honest with you guys. I'm here for Corbin Payne. I, I, I know we came in here for Corbin Payne. The girl, but I am here for Corbin Payne. I am. If I find anything, I'm going deeper for that because he is definitely hidden in the veil somewhere and I am going to look for it. When you said the oh, name Corbin uh, Payne, incredibly a suspect. kind of burned out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the fisherman no situation. Yeah. Oh, yes, he, he up, should oh, not be named. There's a, uh, there's, a, there's a white fishing pole, it says, on sale. Oh, yeah. <laughs> ah, I, I... <laughs> there's there's a lot of questions sale. that we need to ask, um, but let's try and focus on maybe a few because every single time we touch any of this weird stuff i don't know how you guys have felt but i tried to pick up that police document and it turned into a bunch of butterflies and i didn't know where i was <laughs> doesn't it feel like we're all like we're in some kind of like uh probably not accurate like an extra dimensional oh, labyrinth that's designed to contain magical things and won't let us out unless we say the right stuff yeah well yeah i was gonna say it feels like we're Never mind. It sounds dumb. I don't actually think. So, I think Viv doesn't believe that either. So I'll, I won't I'll give it to myself. What's so our what's priority here? Okay. I don't want to interrupt the conversation, to... but I do want to see yeah, what's going on on the top side. <laughs> yeah. What's that? By all means. Yeah. Interrupt. Okay. The what's going on? Uh, let's let's uh, the camera moves through the halls and up, up, up. It reaches the entrance of the store where you've come in. You hear the clocks ticking. What's going on? Duck, you came back. I'm so... You finally oh. noticed? Oh, thank oh goodness God. you're here. Or whatever. I was starting. Yeah, I, I, was, I, was, I, was, and... I was listening to you talk about how you missed me and how you love me. I don't miss you. I don't even... I... Mm -hmm. Who are you again? Ooh. Yeah, that's what you were talking... That's what this conversation was. I, I've just been watching for a while. And like, you, yeah. Just stood silently in the corner watching us? Yeah, it's like a creepy... I, Alex has been teaching me how to do that. Bell. Oh. <laughs> Is there a point at time where we should be worried that they will never come back? I know, I saw them, they'll be okay. Oh? Oh, well, you know, pe people take their time in the store. What the mm -hmm. fuck? Oh, I forgot you were here, dude. Sorry. Yeah, oh, yeah, we keep forgetting hey, hey, I don't, You kids don't know how to behave. You know, back in my day, he starts talking about it. You know, he starts to tell you a long story. Uh, anyway, so, um, um yeah. Oh, I, I, are we all zoning him now? Is it just me? I'm sorry. I might, you know, I'm, in, I'm inclined to give you a status after all these soft moves of some sort, like distracted or, you know, uh, I don't know. I don't know what you're talking I, about, crazy man. I, 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 I don't know. He is so weird. Very weird. Chuck, what did you yeah. see? And are they good? Do we need to yeah, help? Yeah, I think they're good. They're, okay. they're fine. What did they're you good. do? <laughs> Why did you go there? there? That's all. Oh. You I, 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 I just went in a little bit and I found like a little like dragony thing. I think oh. that like if we find the, if we find the girl, maybe we can like swap it out for the for the, another dragony thing. Um, but it's got a flashlight. I blind myself with the, with the light for a little bit and a little bit okay. disorientated from it. But no, I was I, I was able to get back out. It was no problem. You really should oh. have a map though. They should um, have a map. maybe an online. Oh man, store. why don't you have a map or yeah, like that GPS. So thing or something mm -hmm. it's just something anything at this point it's like a jungle in there you need like you need an army of workers to like just to pick the shelves and maybe some robots <gasps> also robots are they paying to... you enough you're paying you paid it all yeah do they even pay you 
I think we're turning the, the annoyance back to him. <laughs> With questions. We're seeing you get a text message from uh, from Pete. It says, you up? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, oh, I'm looking over your shoulder. She a twist. I got a random guy named Peter who know my number block. Is that Big P? <laughs> Who's Big, Big P? P? <laughs> what was his name? About? You don't remember him? That guy was cool. No. What? <laughs> don't worry. Oh. <laughs> I mean, if you're not going for a set of my way, I mean, come on. Uh, my Sin record player Yahweh, broke. What are we talking about? <laughs> I am so confused. <laughs> Remember? I, I haven't been this confused since I last did my own chemistry homework. Which is like two days ago. Why do that when you can pay someone to do it for you? Sure. I mean, I was tr I, usually Lily do it, but uh, I was like, I want to get You know, youngsters, tree. as much as I like to have you in my store, if okay. you're not going to, you know, uh, you know, venture into the back of the store, I, you know, you're going to have to wait outside. We, we have other, we have a lot of customers coming in right now, you know. I like to it's have... It's 11 uh, you, call, do you, you know, I, I don't want to make a big deal out of this, but I feel like you have to go outside and, you know, maybe hang out in the alley. So oh, fuck you too, it's dude. Okay. Like dirty and nasty out there, but cool. All right. Oh, you know, hey, you can stay here in the store, but you're going to take distracted one, each of you. That's all. You know, I don't know you what can that go is. outside and not be distracted at all. Christine, does this guy give you the creeps or what? I'm and very creepy. Is I, so you know, I, have I say it loud enough for him to hear me. As well. I say, I I say it loud enough for him to be able to hear me. This guy's oh my kind goodness. of fucking creepy. Let's go. We can call him where... I'm not as creepy as Mavis's driver, I'll tell you that. I'm just a kindly old is. man. You're He's kind of... Oh so my goodness, bad. why do you know that? He has kids. Oh, He's a great so guy. Creepy. He's a great guy. He has kids. Bye, yeah, bye, I don't bye, know bye. what I'm talking about. I don't know that guy. I I was just making that up. That's kind of weird. I hit the nail on the head. That was a weird thing for you to say, dude. Head. Yeah, that is oh. such a weird thing for you to say. What? Bye. Uh, bye. Uh, all right. Bye. Well, you know. I, I thank like, you for stopping by. Uh, you know, here's Chris, your bro brochure. So, um, Kel, you um, mm, take one before. Should I say yes to this? And I show, like, my what phone. Um, I've got a I've got a message from this guy asking if um, Christine's single or like she's <laughs> dating anyone. Oh my goodness! People well, are so she? obsessed with me, which is perfect. But still, what? Um, I say yeah, she's free single. So I mean, I mean, yeah, it's been a while since I last date. You know how it turns. We out say this that. out in the the uh, alley. Right. Okay. So apply yeah. that you're single. Okay. Yeah, uh, yep. and you yes. make your way out to the alley, and, and then do on, on the you need to thing. do the eye emoji? Okay, one. What? I I, I send Peter the the. the I'm going to tell the you about back. the yes that she's single because Peter's fire, on the football fire, team. Fire fire eye emoji. That's what you put. Okay. What were you saying? Remember Paul? Peter on the football team? He asked me if like if Christine was single, so I just said yeah. The robed figures that were speaking in hushed tones in the alley scatter, or Get sort the of fuck out of here as you uh, as you come out of the out of the store, and we'll go back down into the stacks. Do, 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 do. Oh, you're muted, uh, Paul. Right. Oh no, I, that was me expressing cold. Oh, okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, they just feel just... like they might be one step ahead of you. Uh, because, uh, you, know, you, you felt like you got away work. clean, but they might you might not have after all. But you know, mm. I don't know. Maybe they're just robed people hanging out, doing a little cosplay. So anyway, we're covering the whitening. Level right? two, maybe. It's, are you going deeper into the store? I think we should go deeper. It Let's calls go down. you deeper. Yes, I, I know uh, you want to leave, but there's so much to learn no, first. We're going down. No. I'm just saying, when we get Jeez. to the bottom, your ass is coming back with us, or I'm going to stay here with you, and I'm going to waste my life down here trying to get your ass out of here. I do not concede uh, that it would so. be a waste of life, but I do concede that I will leave with you after we find the things. We will find Ooh, the things. There's a big repository. We will you, find the things. You sort of see a fine... A fine, uh, 
a fine uh, figurine made of uh, quicksilver. It's sort of shaped like a um, uh, like a fox. It's like a fo it, it's a quicksilver fox. But you pass it we by, still... the white go okay. white becomes yellow becomes you know it gets a little bit dimmer, but it's still yellow. It's 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 um it's all over. You thought there was a lot of white in the level before, but now yellow is almost almost everything's yellow. There's yellow books. There's uh, uh the parchment that you see that's faded. It fa it's faded into yellow. Uh, uh, there's you know brightly colored pictures, paintings even, um, gold, uh, gold items, probably real, who knows, in this place. Uh, you, we were looking you for information on a god Wait, king. Hold on. Perhaps didn't this would be the say, floor. Didn't they say, wasn't, what was the, what did they call the ritual that me and Kel were in? It was the, was it the mm -hmm. blackening? Blackening. Yeah, it was the blackening. And mm -hmm. now we're in, we went through a white and then black and now yellow. You were black first and then white and now yellow. Yep. Blackening, the whitening, the yellow, and the ink. That sounds like those alchemical sounds like association. For, yeah. You feel like, you feel deep. So you have a, there's a psychedelic effect in all this. You see a sun sort of fly over and a beam of light hits each of you in the heart as if it's, uh, Warming your very soul. It's making your soul luminous as the sun, you feel. And then it, it fades. Praise and the sun! Fine, the fine trinkets everywhere seem all the more great and call to you even stronger. What do you do? Is it just like objects on this floor? Like no, are there any books or anything? Or Lots of books. Parchment. Books. Is, is know, there a yellow like brick road as well? When you approach, they seem to fade is into their yellow brick road? color. You look down at the floor. I think Alex would reach up and grab a parchment and be like, if we wanted information on, on a cult of a god king, this, this does seem well, like a good place to look. There's bricks what? below you on your feet, you think, but then it seems to just be an ordinary wooden floor. But you, for a <laughs> second, you're like, oh, that's a, those are bricks down. It's a cobblestone. No way. That's only outside. Okay. But I think if we're going by alchemical, right, it's the white, black, yellow, and there's, if we're on the third, like, layer, there must be a fourth layer, and if, there, if we're going to the fourth layer, then that just means that, like, maybe whatever we're looking for is on that fourth layer, because, like, if we're going yeah, through the cycles all... of... I mean, you can look around here. I'm just afraid that you're going to get lost more, but I think I'm aiming for lower. By the that way, you see, um, you see a copy of the book, The Alchemy of the Soul. You remember that ah. back in your apartment, you have a copy of that that you never opened. That would probably would have been no, we helpful. Were, but... we, went, we went through it. We already went through it. We went through it. We opened it. What you was the have, shop called in Chinatown? I mean, there that might have been more you could have looked uh, at. It was called something. It was something. Uh, it was related the, to uh, the alchemy alchemical. shop in in Chinatown. The one we walked into, the yeah. guy was really weird and sus as hell. It was called. Um, it had something to do with the alchemy of the soul. Um, I don't remember. Sorry. Magnum Magnum Opus, which is exactly what the cult Magnum uh, said Opus. Something that's right. about that. Oh look, there's okay, a book that so... says Magnum Opus too, right there. Who knew? Oh, that's convenient. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you don't know if it's going to say anything. Of... Alchemy of the Soul is the same as ours. Can I pull it off the shelf? Yeah, it looks the same. It looks the same. It's the only difference is there's not a uh, uh, there's not like a you know it's not it doesn't have the specific like imprint of the library or there was something in the in the be in the front of it uh, I can't remember what it was it might have been a library stamp it doesn't have that. I mean, yeah, if we're talking about the mm. good question. No, we, we had, like, R1 has people who checked it out. Oh, but maybe this one has somebody else. Um, well, Magnum said. Opus, um, as we know, is... Well, I mean, huh. would you I count... You hear some I, chanting. I, 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 as, you, as you flip through the pages, you think you hear chanting. And then you close the book, the chanting disappears. <laughs> 
I mean, magnum opus for the cult of the god king. It just makes sense, doesn't it? The cult of a god king would have the magnum opus, and there's a store called the magnum opus that sells alchemical supplies, and this weird ass oh, cult I guy gives you a book to do with alchemical. What's the called? It. I just feel like there's a connection there. Maybe we could find something. Maybe you know, a, like a videotape of CCTV yeah. inside the store or something? Maeve knows Latin. So, is there... Oh yeah, it's creepy. Very dope. Very Polly, Polly, Maeve knows Latin, so I think I would understand what that's saying if I was listening close enough. Yeah, it says, Life-giving father, I follow the thread of the mystic spider through your labyrinth of lies. To join you in the holy of holies. When my body rots, I will be absolved. My spirit washed by quicksilver. My soul uh -oh. becomes luminous as the sun. I burn to unite with your sacred fire. I have become God on earth. Um, okay. okay, well, that's, you know what? that's that pretty enlightening. Lot. But yeah, <laughs> I feel like I feel like Maeve like says this as like as it's saying it, she's like repeating what it's saying, and then she kind of like every time after she like finishes, she like looks at Penny and is like kind of just makes like a face, just like a like a very inquisitive face. Um, but uh, I think it was more just like because that was that never mind she said she thought it she like do, do i look hot doing that like is that like was that good uh so <laughs> no but, yeah do it later stop flirting i can't help it my girlfriend is pretty um so <laughs> it's true it's true there, there, there was there was quicksilver there was quicksilver and and then there was my my soul felt my soul felt warm and fuzzy did, did your soul feel warm and fuzzy no, but I felt a sudden tinge of metal in my mouth whenever that was said. Like I'd swallowed a really bad pill or something. You know, um, when we talk about Penny the wouldn't soul... know about this. <laughs> I get it. Penny doesn't. When, <laughs> when we talk about the soul, it seems like sometimes people associate our like legends with the soul. The way that the, the way that the professor talked about it, he talked about shedding parts of our soul. To, or like the book says something about shedding parts of our soul and then the professor said something about shedding our powers mm. the pa and in favor of powers that are stronger so giving up one's soul maybe if we had continued with remember how we said that rachel was using myths and legends and whatever our powers are linked to and using them to create candy to create those desires and those like yeah. dreams to come to life do you think it's like the same thing, like taking them out and using them to create a god? Uh, could be. Um, they're absolutely connected, 100%. The What happened in that area and what's happening with this weird cult is 100%, you know, on the same page. But um, what well, I feel like Rachel what you just well, said really nails it down. What she just said, while Mavis was talking, while she was describing her thoughts, in the distance, you heard a kettle drum banging louder and louder. When she stopped speaking, the kettle drum stopped. It was. It was like, I'm going to take that as confirmation. Chat talked about. Chat talked about fire, and and Rachel was using fire to, to steal, our whatever. Do you guys know any cultures that use um? Quicksilver have immortality written down on tablets and obsessed with like alchemy and fire and whatnot. Do you guys know any cultures that do that? I, I haven't really traveled very much. I know and a lot really of stories. Studious part of history. You know, there's the story there's of the Holy Grail. Medieval. There's the yeah. story of vampires. There's a lot of things that have you know immortality as a story element. Um, specifically, um, something to do with Chinatown. Maybe Europe, Quicksilver was. Um... Related to immortality. Oh, that's good. Well, I hope, what what culture was that? Maybe we could find something here. Maybe you, you might have to roll to find something here. 
Yeah, I think we don't. Is it worth? Is it worth it? Isn't? I, I think we should press on. I... The brightness of the room begins to fade ever so slightly, but insistently as you talk and and uh, and delay. All the webs. I think we're going deeper. Yeah, we're, we're going pulled deeper. Through another threshold, the light, the, the the sun turns black for a second, and you and around you suddenly it looks like for but a moment you're in a circle of fire. The walls turn blood red. They get brighter and brighter. Well, There's no heat. The it's clearly just a light effect. Suddenly, yeah. the 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 uh, uh the whole room seems like it's gone, and you're surrounded by a you know uh, uh just flames that enter closer and closer and closer. Suddenly, they they uh they they fall and give way to books and items and the maze that you're in before, except the floor is red, the ceiling is red, and there's flickering all around. There's still a psychedelic wavy effect. It's becoming harder and harder for you to see quite clearly. You feel as if you are have to go far off in the distance. You can feel, you cannot see because it's so amazing. There is a black hole. It's almost, it, the gravity is, is you're being heavier and heavier and you feel like the, you're com being compelled to be pulled. No more looking at this stuff. Go straight down into the hole. What do you do? There, you, you could resist it right now. There's no mechanical force on you. This is just a compelling feeling for you. Yeah, definitely not going to go into the black top plate. side. You you feel something. You feel yourself compelled to go into the store again and take no ca throw caution to the wind and follow your friends. You know that's foolhardy. It's just a it's just an impulse. Does any of you do you do anything about it? Ah, uh, uh, it's calling me. How foolish of them to call me. <laughs> uh, that's why uh, you need to take the blue pill. Let's do it. I already um, took one. And if give, you take give the blue it to pill, the feeling to fades, and you are relieved because you know that was going uh, to be uh, a very bad decision. However, if anybody does not take the blue pill, does anybody not take the blue pill? Uh, the purple I, smoke can kind of flow out because the eyes a little bit, and she goes. Oh, you guys are no fun. But then she eat the pills. Okay. And and the store with the neon sign, it says open 24 hours. The neon sign goes out. And it says closed. Oh. Uh, we go back down into the down below into the store. And we'll come back and say we go down to the floor. What do you do? You're being pulled. You're oh, saying, forget it. There is everything I need to know is this way. Yeah, I think I... Alex actually grabs Meg's hand, which never happened. Oh, yeah, we're, human we're grabbing each other's hands at this point. We have to go. We've come this far. We have, we have to do, we have to do it. We have to do it. We've come this far. We have to do it. We have to do it. Come on. Come on. Alex. Like, Alex. They'll start pulling. Alex. Pulling. No, look, we, I pulled back. Sometimes, we look. Mm. Frost. Sometimes the only way out is through. Okay, don't use poetry at me to get your way here. That's a void of like whatever could be. We are obviously in the reddening. I don't know what's after that. I this is very scary and it feels like some kind of black hole and it could be. What if it's a black hole and we're just like wh what if we just get sucked in and we die? And our this is what Ooh, if this is actual the actual black the hole thing... then we would be flattened into a small okay, strand of Alex, particles by the gravity. Alex, if I was... it's just if this was reality, I wouldn't be able to, you wouldn't be able to turn invisible and I wouldn't be able to create bubbles that can float cars in the air and contain buildings that are about to explode. Okay? I don't think reality matters here. I think it's the fact that whatever we believe is real is real. Okay? And so if that is a black hole, what if that's the reason that people never Why go up just... again? Are, are we Why surrounded by objects now? Or is the and we're voice? Yeah, like, uh, uh, the fire disappeared, gave way to like a deeper, you know, even more compacted room with stuff everywhere. You know, there's artifacts, trinkets, books, all of the same stuff. Uh, you know, maybe a hint of music, a banging going on somewhere around there, but a compelling black hole 
through the maze. You don't even, you won't get lost. You'll just wind your way right there and all of your questions will be answered and it will be worth it. You, you yeah, that's a trap. lost out on knowledge by bailing out. I like Maybe to take the, the time to be a little brave. No. Okay. Uh, on, logic on, and all on. sanity would lead us to believe that we need to leave that alone. That is quite clearly a trap. If we are currently wow. surrounded by the objects, we don't need to go any deeper. Let's do it right here, right now. Find what we need and leave. Yeah, like every part see. of me is every instinct of my curiosity wants to go, and that's a bad sign. Curiosity <sighs> killed this cat once. It's not happening again. Alex. What if you just, what if you never come back? And I know that, like, you don't like your life what if that you never much. Come but, back? Like, What's the worst that happens, Maeve? What's the worst? What's the worst that happens? I lose one of the only friends that I have that actually makes sense. I lose someone who actually understands what I'm talking about when I talk about big concepts. The only person that could probably help me understand why this city is the way that it is. The only person that could probably expose most of the shit that happens in the city, we would lose that person. I would lose a friend. I would lose someone who actually makes my day better. Are you recording this? <laughs> no. Oh, I want to give Christine what? the spotlight because yeah, she uh, uh, Mario. What's up? What can we? Uh, okay. <laughs> Purple smoke still flowing out of her eyes, even though uh. I took the bill and I go, I can't believe I'm going to do this. All of you are going to owe me your name after this. And she goes, those who are going to get lost, they're going to get lost in my realm. And I like to touch the ground and use my power to change the game. Okay. What are you delusional talking? manifestation. Okay. Um, I like to use my touch up delusion, whimsify object function and alter existing physical property to turn the role into like a running uh, like a arrow <laughs> leads back to us by and and send that to people to help them if they want to get out. So those okay. who's lost but want to find a way back to me can do that, can use that as like a bonus. Okay. The All story right. tech. All right. That sounds good. Is it a yellow brick road? <laughs> yes, it, it's a purple, it's a purple brick row instead. I love it. <laughs> let's ask our questions and get the hell out of here so uh let me see if i can help with that first uh so i just use those three tags i have a minus one from fatigue okay yeah and then let me see if there's any sorry i'm looking to see if there's any weakness tags i can um you I also can, got a chat uh, donation too yes i Thanks, might magic. have to use that you might want thank to thank you Thank you so much. If I, I, if, I had a, if I had a harm, I'd totally be using it. But anyway, there's no weakness <laughs> tag I, I would invoke here. So, okay, so I'm gonna use one chat point. The total of plus three. Hopefully, this can help them. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so you got a mild success. You can uh, uh, create a story tag. It sounds like you want to create a story tag, and then. Unfortunately, you can't make it ongoing. You could burn a power tag or a story tag or give or reduce the status. So um, earlier in the monologue, he gave us one more juice. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's true. I like to use that juice. <laughs> okay. <laughs> to make it ongoing. Um, oh, you can't. And uh, you can't okay, okay. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Because I think oh, it says, okay. uh, I think specifically when you have, well, I'll let you do it. I'll let you do it. It can be a, so, a power. Thank you. It can be a change the game uh, 10 plus juice. So you can create um, a and, ongoing. And I would, uh, I would call this um, run way back to me. A story okay. tag, run way back to me. And I'm going to use that one juice to make it ongoing so they can find that way. And you can scale you it up could, and hide. Um... Oh, go ahead. Oh, you can't scale you, it up. Sorry. You could reduce our statuses, like our lost statuses instead. That sounds Yeah, like that, that, that would be better. Do. Sure. I, I would love to do that. So I'll do all of that. We don't actually okay. have them yet. No, Alex has status of full oh, I have lost. It. 
we're, we're about yeah. to get a lot more so maybe we should structure it so that happens after <laughs> no I would, well, wouldn't this be is to. ongoing it's... so yeah why don't, well, we, why don't and... we just get rid of alex's statuses because i feel like alex is the one that will be the hardest to get out <laughs> i i agree for the right now for the that's what's happening completely agree um but we're about to ask questions in the biggest area i feel like i mean mm -hmm. penny definitely is going to like yeah and, and uh, <laughs> okay so here's the thing uh, it looks like we're running out of time. So yeah. do you want to get any questions or you want to do geek out during the credits and save the big questions for next week? I, really I think we should geek out. No, so do I, I but I feel like we, so we should geek out. I know, Come so on, do I. Just, just like one question. Okay, one question. <laughs> one question. Okay, I wanted Geech? to burn my... Oh. <laughs> What's your name? One... <laughs> Okay. I, uh, I, I can I, really... I can wait. The suspense will do me good. Go ahead. Ah, uh, fine, fine. I guess I can. I just wanted to burn my tag to roll for a hit. Uh, for okay, I have one question. You Go got ahead. To, well, you also got to juice now. You can ask questions what next time, but you can ask one question now. But I'll one tell question you what. Now. Okay. Yeah. In fact, I'll tell you what. I'll let you because you have suffered so much. I'll I'll give you one question for free, and then we can resolve anything else next time. One question. One question. Um, and it must uh, be a question. Can no I ask? Can I ask the MC something though? That juice that we might have or have not have, is that going to be lost after this session? Yes. Yeah. It's only ask one your question session. now. <laughs> Use your juice now. Okay. Um. I, I, I oh, 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 okay, okay. There's Corbin a lot Payne of questions, but there's Corbin some. Payne or the girl. Corbin Payne. Or Corbin the girl. Payne. Who, okay, Corbin Payne. Go, Fisherman. Yep. Corbin Payne. Uh, who is Corbin Payne? I, 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 like just any kind of answer. Who is Corbin Payne? Who like I not like the stuff that I know. Like who? who the I, black. No, bad question. The black holes grows in size. You kind of already know who Corbin Payne is. Give me something more narrow. Okay. Corbin Payne is. Um, who is the God King? Is Corbin no, Payne no, the God King? Not my question. No, he's. Yeah, I, I'm that's... not asking that question. Where is Corbin Payne? I, where is. I. Oh, that's a good question. That's a good question. Oh, oh yeah. okay, give me two seconds. Give me two well, seconds. We, could, we, we, we know he's here. Um, we know he's in the city, so we don't really need to know specifics. What's Corbin Payne's what? name? His name is Corbin Payne. Corbin Payne. What is Corbin Payne's? Ooh, is what? What is Corbin Payne's myth? Can I look through the mist and see, like, if I could find something about that instead? Yeah, is Corbin okay. Payne the rift? <laughs> you think? You think? You 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 uh uh, uh your mind's eye. You, you fall to the floor because you hit an eternal question of the city. There's something very deep about Corbin Payne. Corbin Payne is, of course, no ordinary avatar. In fact, it would be an insult. It would be an insult to him to call him an avatar. There is a there is greater forces in the city that that even avatars aspire to be a part of he is on top of those he is the, the the being behind the being pulling the strings of the city you don't know what that means more than that but his mythos is the fisher king i knew it. and we'll go to geek out during the credits <laughs> i called it okay anyways yeah. geek out during the credits. what we do fisher thank king. you for the uh, session today <laughs> You're right. Viv is dying. <laughs> yeah, yes, I'm excited. excited. You kill. You kill Viv. <laughs> no, no, okay, I'm go, sorry. go, go. Let's go. Let's go. I mean, you kind of already saw that coming because I was sort of leaning there. But now, now, if you think about the myth, you can see where things might be heading. There's plenty of mm -hmm. things that that follow from that as well. So now that that's confirmed, you have an open avenue of, <laughs> of investigation that might lead you to the Knights of Pain Town. Oh, sorry, that was that was cheesy, but so, I sorry. What? <laughs> no, it's perfect. Yeah. It was perfect. What are you talking All right. about? As in knights, <laughs> as in swords and sorcery knights. I don't know. Or... I don't know. The book says N I D. Uh, yeah. well, yeah. well, I was just saying. <laughs> uh, all right. So the last move of every session is geek out during the credits, and the way we do that is you get to choose one of those options, and then we will also ask you to tell us who you are and where we can find you. I take volunteers first because sometimes it's difficult to, to choose which one of the geek out during the credits 
choices you would like to make, such as how has the crew grown this session? What character had the most meaningful action interaction with me and uh, my character of the session? Or which of your themes is under the most strain? What will happen if it collapses entirely? Who would like to go first? Chuck. No, no one really Chuck interacted you know, with then... me all session and I'm getting kind of <laughs> used to it. Um, but I did like um, being able to do like the phone. Crit. What? Christine literally was like, I was like worried. Yeah. I'm worried about you. I yeah, I know. This is this is like no really mega interaction to and fro. Um, but there was stuff when he wasn't there about him. Um, but I wanted to, I just wanted to like do the um, A plus to Christine. Um, but I also wanted to do a hurt to Christine. I don't know which one to do. <laughs> um, so I'm probably going to do a hurt to Christine um, for the interactions that we had. Every time okay. Christine, I just want to say every time Christine is nice to you, you always take a hurt point on her. Like that session, it's so funny. Mm. So it's also yeah, like, this, like, this, this is the this is the reason why Christine doesn't like you. <laughs> you secretly drugged her as well. Let's not forget. So, to for a good cause, but still. <laughs> mm. Like every goddamn time, Christine's like, "I'm so sick of this guy. I just want him to disappear now." Because every time. <laughs> And you can find me oh, here, and we've got other stuff going on, and we're also going to be raiding somewhere, so stick around. Okay, uh, who would like to go next? All right, uh, go ahead, um, Cal. Uh, to balance it out, I'll give Christina a uh, help point, I suppose. Because um, <laughs> we had that little talk that didn't get to go anywhere, but I remember it. We talked. <laughs> mm -hmm. We yeah. talk, we grow as a, as a crew. Yeah, as a friend. Mm -hmm. So yeah, uh, I thought okay. that was enough to balance it out. Um, my name is Chris. You can find me in my house. Please don't go looking for it. Okay. Uh, who would like to go next? I'll I'll go next since I got a right. and help point. Go ahead. Uh, so my name is Gabby. I've been playing Christine Chu, and I'm going to take a help point on Kel. Uh, because we have that talk and, you know, start remembering them more and just have that little check-in, we geeky, things are good. Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, and yeah, I would take a hurt point on Chuck if I could because he's still around. <laughs> um, and, right. yeah, yeah, you can find me uh, approximately seven days from now um, playing in this very channel. <laughs> come on, yeah. Please come back to watch us. Uh, we've got Oz, right? Pax. Not yet, but it's coming. Oh, are we? Mm. Okay. Next week. Right. No, oh, it's it's, it's not new. It's 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 like twenty odd days, but yeah, it's coming. Either oh. way. All right. So, All right. Uh, who's next? I can Penny. Uh, okay. My name is Paul. Absolute pleasure. I had the honor of playing Penny Roberts. Uh, you can find me on various other Twitch streams. I'm also a honored member of the Exploding Kittens podcast. I'm great fun on that one. I'm on Gallybond at Twitch TV. We play some d and I'm on the Action Sturge. We play various different systems. Playing Blades in the Dark. Incredibly similar to this one. Great, great fun. Uh, uploaded irregularly, but still amazing fun. And that's me. All right. Thank you. Uh, what about Alex? You ready? No, wait, wait. Paul, what are you taking? What are you doing? Oh, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Muted. <laughs> I would like to do how has the crew grown this session because I feel oh, like right. as a as a group we managed to, you know, immediately after accidentally murdering someone, quote unquote, and then dealing with a bunch of other things that <laughs> happened. Immediately, Penny is very heartfeltly impressed. That they jumped into the deep end, even though they were exhausted, to try and help a kid. And I feel like that's a massive show of empathy and group growth. So I feel like that's yeah. definitely what happened today for me. And okay. sociopathic so behavior will... after murdering somebody. Are you, are you mad? I'm marking attention. attention. Okay, you yeah. can also unburn a tag if you want. I could, but we could just unburn it next week anyway. <laughs> no, but we can also unburn a tag. <laughs> We've had them burn for a long time. Yeah, It's just library though, right? Library and, and Maeve's science. apartment are burned. No, no, ah. no, just Maeve's and library are burned. I thought it was just library. So in that case, Maeve's apartment would be unburned, please and thank you. Because we have to oh, use right. that. Me and Penny have to use that next week after this. Yep. We're going to burn it up. <laughs> We're going to burn it up. 
is that something that we should note about in the group text when like we need to no. clear the clear the headquarters? No. I hope it's so. Fine. Different, it's different, also different my house. <laughs> it's fine. Right the back on the on the door. It's okay. we, yeah, we're, we're quiet enough. My room is far away enough from you guys. You don't have to worry about it. Don't worry about it. Space time. You're telling that to the person it. that can both walk through walls and see through walls. <laughs> Chuck is not allowed to see through or walk through walls in my apartment without permission. Now it's just been. A I may have to uninstall some cameras. Oh. <laughs> don't Why? love that. <laughs> Why are you like this? <laughs> oh. I mean, don't don't uninstall mine. Is all I'm gonna say. You don't so have money for your up. personal use, but you have money for security cameras. It's my own. Don't mind. Like you're paying it for it. Me? Alex, do you want to go? Or Kate, do you want to go, or should oh, I go? Easy to... yeah, yeah, I can go. I can go. Um, uh, I am uh, Ravenrock. I've been playing Alex Storm. Um, I am really torn between crew growth and um, giving Mavis a help point. I'll give Mavis a help point. Um, no, you. Uh, yeah, look, look, Maeve called Alex a friend, and for like the first time, Alex wasn't like, did, did not reframe it, did not uh, give it a new title. So we might almost maybe be friends now. Maybe we are definitely friends. We're already friends. <laughs> Alex just needs I just to come to your apartment. You just live in my apartment. We're roommates? Yes, Alex, we're roommates. You stole keys to my apartment. You live in my apartment. You eat my food. You're my roommate now. <laughs> the only one um, that buys fresh milk. I, I love you. Never yeah. leave. And the ice cream. Yeah. Uh, okay, did you shout yourself out? I did. Okay, all right. So, huh. finally. Uh, I Me. Hi. I usually go first. I wanted to go last this time because I always go first for everyone. Um, I am going to, uh, see it's, I'm torn between, I was going to take the crew theme, but then I saw Chuck didn't listen to me. So I'm just really frustrated again that no one listened to me. So I think I'm going to take a help. I want to, I'm torn between help and hurt on Alex because I want to help Alex, but helping Alex might be hurting Alex, um, and stopping them from doing dumb things. So I think I actually will take a hurt point on Alex because I already have a help point on you. And, um... I think in this case, I really want you to not do dumb things. And I think now I've realized that like you have that same drive in a different way, not in a mystical way and more of a Alex way, um, which is probably even worse because it is you. It's just you. Um, so I'll take a hurt point. And that means that I have a hurt point on every person in the party now. I can take you oh, all God. out. Uh, <laughs> I finally did it. I collected oh, yeah. all my it finally did it. I collect them all. Exodia has been unleashed. <laughs> so, um, and then my name is Oblivion. I stream around sometimes. I am live, I think, every, I try to do every Saturday. I wasn't live this Saturday because my job sucks, um, but I will try to be live next Saturday. And um, I am on randomly. So either follow me on Instagram, Twitter, or on Twitch, and you can find when I stream sporadically all right and i am polly and i have it's been my distinct pleasure to be your mc today and now i would like to turn it back over oh wait you can find me at switch.tv's polly people that's my that's where i stream between tuesdays and saturdays beginning at 3 p.m pacific 6 p.m eastern and if you're in the uk bro it would be 2300 uh facts love i would not like to turn it over what's that facts Pop love bye uh, cheerio. I will now turn it back over to Karsh, the <gasps> real me. MC, the true MC. That's me. Hi, everybody. Um, we are going to be raiding um, Insomnia, Insomnia Night King RPG. They're playing Call of Cthulhu at the moment. Um, and we have, uh, so you have Shotomo, The Alignment, um, which is weird and wonderful and also a Powered by Apocalypse game. And pretty much just as crazy as this one so come and join us for that one all our stuff's on youtube so it's pretty much we wait we release everything at the end of the week thank you everyone for coming in thank you magic Man, for your support of the channel and the gift subscriptions um it does help us out and um we're in a pretty bad well they're, they're in a bad situation we're fine upstairs we had the blue peel um apparently um no one gave me a help point for saving the day by giving people the blue pill uh either way I'm, I'm just kidding. I didn't expect it to have an effect. Um, so we're going to be raiding. Um, share the love and um, enjoy your dice. And remember that the MC is not our friend. Don't take the bait. Don't take the candy. 
Um, she has a tendency of doing that. Um, I was surprised somebody did. <laughs> it's right there. The, 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 the newest character and the player that wasn't here for the foundry. Yeah, for so, all of the, yeah. Now I know. <laughs> yeah, don't take the candy. Are you now? Yeah. Mm. Um, so um, we'll see you next week um, or we'll see you tomorrow. Um, and we should, in theory, have Circus back this week. In theory. Mm. If Fingers I get crossed. more work on the overlay done to make it stable. I had to, had to do a complete rebuild. But anyway, we're doing a raid. Take care and see everybody. Bye. Bye. Ta-ra.